Um, let's see. There we go. I hate whenever I have to mess with any, uh, whatchamacallit, any settings during the stream because Persona 4 stops <laughs> in the background. Uh, one of the things I forgot to do before I started the stream, I have to resync my audio. Jesus fuck. Because that's going to be really hectic in the future if I do not do that. Good thing I remembered at the last second. Last possible second. Nope. Nope, that's not it. There we go. There you go. Hopefully audio is synced back up. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think that's uh synced up, right? Should be. Unless OBS wants to lie to me. Alright, so <clears throat> anyways, now that all that funky stuff is out the way. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, man, machine, everything in between. Welcome to a uh, more Persona 4 Golden. Right? We kind of took a week off for Persona, and we took like, what, two weeks off for Ace Attorney? So I'll be streaming that this week again. Um, so, last time we played Persona 4 Golden. Cut it out. I'm talking here. Cut it out. Shut up. Shut your face. What are you doing, game? Stop it. Now's not the time for intros. Last time we played Persona 4 Golden, we stopped uh, right after we got Rize. Um, We are on the hunt for what we believe to be the killer. A high schooler named uh, Mitsuo, I think that's his name. And was this the save that... I'm pretty sure this is the save file. That I left off on? I think it is. Yeah. Let's see. Stats. Ah, yes, because Yosuke is a pathetic level 19. <laughs> ah, Yosuke. Pain in the ass you are. You and Chie. Just horrible, the both of you. So, we're back with more Persona 4 Golden. Right? I'm a little out of it right now, not gonna lie. Uh, I'm a little tired, had a long day today. Got, got like what, maybe four hours of sleep before the stream, so uh, I'm not, I'm not fully here, not yet, anyways. But there is some things that I did do. I finally took some time out of my schedule a little bit <coughs> to prepare for this stream. Uh, first things first, there is another save file that we're gonna switch to in a bit, mainly because. Uh, I needed to prog uh, progress the story a little bit just to uh, get back into the TV world and fucking and grind out for like four hours or something. I don't know. Uh, basically, just get our characters to a nice level to where we're not gonna get our asses handed to to us in the uh, next dungeon, right? So I did that. Uh, didn't do anything else. Um, Anything else of note, really, didn't do any social links or anything like that. So, as of right now, I think we are searching for that boy. And what we have to do to get information for Rize, if I believe it, if I believe it to be correct. Um, I think we are on the first day of doing the investigation for that. So we need to head over to Simagawa. Even though I'm pretty sure that's not how you pronounce that, but... I've, I've come accustomed to that. Head down here. Talk on over to Kanji. What's up, Kanji? Hmm, info on the suspect. It's pretty tough. Seems like no one knows anything, huh? But instead of bitching about it, why don't we go right to the source? Just ask Dojima-san. Your uncle, right? He'll tell you something. Maybe Kanji's right. Hey, man, listen. I know Kanji's unfortunately stupid. But, uh... At some point... A stupid person has to have a brilliant idea, yeah? <laughs> so let's do that. 
Head on back to the shopping district. Oops, I went to Junaz. My bad, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Head on back to the shopping district. And like fucking Houdini, Dojima's just right here. A clue to the criminal investigation. You? I told you not to stick your neck into things. There's no way I tell you. Jeez, damn. Where did the dot you go off to? You can't seem to get any information out of him. Hmm, that sucks. So now we gotta look for a dachi, but for some reason, I don't know who programmed it, but um, when it comes to investigating for stuff, you can only talk to like two people of note, and then it'll progress the next day, so that's all we can do for now. I'm gonna run into the velvet room because I think Marie might have something for us. Nope, she doesn't. Alright, well, fuck you, Marie. I gotta remember to uh, hang out with Marie more. Alright, well, now that we're done with that, there's really nothing else for us to do, right? So I'm just gonna do what I did off screen and start preparing for one of the uh, Fox requests, which, uh, which we head over to the Dojima residence for. I'm gonna start taking a ride around the block. Right around the neighborhood. Let's walk around the block and see who we meet up and down our street. Um. Give me a quick second. I'm actually gonna lower the volume on the game audio. seem to be a little loud. I think that's a good audio for it. Alright. Do that. After getting completely lost, you reach the station. But you feel as if you're starting to get the feeling for the place. You'll need to ride around a little bit more to get better acquainted with the area. Your courage has increased. Aren't you a brave boy? I'm a brave boy. The bravest of boys. Hi, Nanako. You can work as a janitor tonight, but I'm not gonna do that. I'm trying to remember what I did at night time during this moment before I started grinding off screen. I think, I honestly think I just worked. Is that what I did? I don't remember. I think I worked. I think that's what I did. Origami Cranes, translation, translation. You decided to work on translating. You had a hard time translating expressions in foreign languages. Your expression has increased. Uh, speculate from context. Ah, oh, damn it. You're too dumb to speculate. Stupid idiot. Trying to use your brain? What's wrong with you? Alright, second day of investigation. Wanna head your ass outside. Something that the youth don't do no more. Cause now you're all stuck on your my journals and your in your her spaces. Head over to Junez. Hey you see a dachi! I think I'll stay here a little longer before I go out again. Hmm. Ah, uh, you startled me. Don't sneak up on me like that. What's going on? Do uh, do you know investigating? I'll tell Dojima. Better spill the beans. Did Dojima-san say something about it? Just keep this a secret from him, please. Wait, what? Clues to catch a suspect? If I tell you, you'll keep quiet. All right then. I'm just talking to myself here, but he supposedly had a part-time job in the shopping district. Where was it? Uh, I don't think they told me that much. Seems that Adachi has purposely leaked some information. Where exactly did the suspicious boy work? <coughs> uh, I had something in my throat. Either that or I was dying. I can't tell which one. Head over to the shopping district. You're gonna scoodle your boodle up here. That's what we're gonna do. 
I'm like really hungry right now, which is weird because I ate like, I want to say like four hours ago, five, six, six hours ago. Hold up, let me do the math in my head. Oh, I guess it was like six hours ago I ate. Jesus, it doesn't feel like it. Talk to this lady. She's like, man, dude used to work here, but this was a while ago. I had him cutting the meat, but he got bored with the work very quickly. Out here slinging that slang and slinging that meat. Cutting it up. I remember he had black eyes. And what else? Oh yeah, he said the person who worked here before him was his classmate during middle school. I see that kid, his classmate around here sometimes. Maybe you should talk to him. I don't know if you'll find him today, but I recently dyed his hair golden brown, so he should be easy to spot. If you find his if you find his golden brown haired classmate, you'll probably obtain some information. Cool. Now here's the stupidest part. We gotta progress one more day in order for this guy to show up, and that's the last thing we need to do, which really sucks because it's like it's like why you gotta make me wait more days? Why you gotta make me waste days, man? I don't like it. It's almost as bad as the fucking cat keep telling me to go to sleep. I don't like it. It's bad. But yeah. Can't really do nothing else today. Like yesterday. So just gonna hop on this scooter. You're gonna ride around the neighborhood. You gotta ride around the neighborhood like three times before you can take a long ride, right? After getting lost, you reach the hill overlooking town, but you feel as if you've gotten very good feeling for this place. If you ride around a little more, you'll be completely familiar with the area. Despite the fact that you spent like already, what, like fucking three months? <laughs> three, four months in this town? Somehow you're not familiar with the area yet? I don't know. Welcome home, Nanako. Yeah, that's right. I'm welcoming you home, even though I just stepped through the door. You can work as a janitor, but I don't care about that. Alright. Start working? Yeah, translate. You decide to work on translating. Having a hard time translating expressions in foreign language. Expression has increased. Encounter sitting that seems to have been written by a child. Right as a child would. Writing the lines in child speech patterns turns out to be pretty fun. Your pace, your pace has increased. Your pen won't stop moving. You're damn right. You get 12,000 bucks. That's cool. You get 12,000 schmickle schmeckles. Fog will come in several days, man. Gotta get information for Rize. Alright. Don't know why I opened the menu. That was the stupidest thing I've ever done in my life. Now run outside. That's what we gotta do. Head back into town. And go on down back to the shopping district. At this point, if you haven't, make sure you go over to the shop over here and upgrade your equipment. Right? Buy some provisions from the lady if you need it. Talk to this dude. Huh? You wanna see my yearbook? Oh, you're looking for him. You want to see his picture? <laughs> you do, don't you? Why are you being so weird about this? Well, today's your lucky day because me and my friend are gonna are going around showing it to everyone. You want a copy? Obtain the boy's picture. There's no doubt that the boy in the picture is one you saw on the Midnight Channel. The name is written below the picture. Mitsuo Kobo. Kobo? Kubo. My bad. So this is the suspicious boy's name. You should report this to Rize. Cool. I love how this guy acts like a shady dealer. He's like, oh, so you want to see the picture of him? Hmm, okay. I'll show it to you. It's your lucky day. You get a little taste for free. You get them hooked on the good shit, but then you never give them the good shit. You keep them coming back for more. And that's how you become a drug dealer. <laughs> All right. So now, with that information, you're going to run your little ass over to Junaz. Go gather everybody in the food court and progress with the story. Sensei, 
I'm all ready to go. Why the fuck? Oh my god. I hate looking at this damn thing. Sorry, I had to like click off of a fucking notification I get every time I stream. It's all like, your virus scan has been complete, dog. Do you want to like update shit now or something? And it's like, get out of my face, dude. I keep telling you not to do that shit, but you still do it. Makes me upset a little bit. Show the picture of Mitsuo Kubo to the others. That's him, all right. It's definitely the guy on the Midnight Channel. It's settled then. He is the killer. And he's in here now. This guy came to our shop before. Was he spying on me? That creep. Oh my god. I really was being targeted. Damn it! Freaking punk! Hey, I've seen him before too. Hmm. Oh, now I remember. Yukiko, it's that one guy! That one guy? Yeah, for real, Chie, that one guy? There's a lot of guys. Back in April, remember? He suddenly came and started hitting on you? I mean, like, half the school? Oh, him! The dude who got served by Yukiko in front of the school. <laughs> okay, Yosuke. Man, Chie, how'd you remember something like that? Well, that was the first time he talked to her, but I remember he was always following her around. Um, sorry, who are we talking about? The dude who came right up to you at the school gates and called you Yuki? Oh. Uh, really? Wait, did he kidnap Yukiko to get back at her for rejecting him? Um, I didn't really reject him. That's some, like, Reddit slash nice guy type shit. <laughs> reject him, he's like, alright, bitch, I didn't like you anyways. Kidnap her, throw her in the TV. He came up to me while I was busy working and asked, Don't the biker gangs bother you? That's a pretty normal question. Just going on and on about how biker gangs can't do anything unless they're in a pack and stuff. He seemed to be the type who just keeps talking whether you like it or not, if that makes sense. Ah, so he's like me. Great. I usually treat those people politely so they don't get offended, but I was so tired that I kind of ignored him. But in the back of your mind, you're just like, shut the fuck up, shut the fuck up, shut the fuck up, shut the fuck up. Was that why I was kidnapped? Huh? Wait, I I'm not a biker. Ugh, a damn special report. So that's why I got dragged into this. You know, I heard he's been saying stuff about that announcer's affair, too. Lots of muttering about how women who cheat on their husbands should be executed. Sounds like it's all coming together. Well, it's time for a showdown. Can you tell where this Mitsuo guy's at? Yeah, Rize. Give it a try. Do your Just thing. A sec. Yeah, I found him. He's that way. Let's go! We're so close to the killer. We can't lose him now. <coughs> I had to cough. I couldn't hold it in any longer. What is this? Some kind of game? Yeah. What is this? A video game? Well, he did taunt us, saying try and catch me. I guess he thinks of all this as a game. Let the games begin! Gotta admit, all guys love games. And all girls love Teddy. Don't look at him, guys. Just ignore him. He'll go away soon. Yeah, pinpointing Misuo Kubo's location. All that's left is to reach him where he's waiting. You should prepare yourselves to find and apprehend him. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Dun, dun, dun. All right. So before I uh, before I uh, switch over to the other save file, 
I at least got to go up by like three floors because that's what I did in my other save file. And then I realized I shouldn't be doing that because then we'll just miss some dialogue if I reload it. So let's do that real quick. Who's going to be joining us on this excursion is Yosuke. Kanji. And newcomer, Teddy. All right. Going to be leaving the dynamic duo over here out of it. Mainly because I want to show off, uh, mainly because I want to show off, uh, Yosuke's and Teddy's, like, team-up attack, right? And also, Kanji's just great to have on your team all the time. That and, I mean, Yosuke said it himself, guys love games, so might as well have all the guys just go in, right? Begin a new quest? End your quest. Begin new quest. Please enter your name. Huh? What is this? Mitsuo. Does this mean the game's starting? Ugh, this kind of pisses me off. Let's go, senpai. Let's go, simpy. All right, cool. So, if you can't tell already... Oh, shit. <laughs> Uh-oh. Try not to get caught by these guys. So I don't, like, instantly die. Uh-oh. Bad room. Bad touch. Bad touch. Get away from me. Oh, God. Alright, so, Dungeons video game theme. And in this game, I would say this is one of my favorite dungeons. Mainly because of the video game thing, uh, theme and also the uh, the music that they. Oh, shit! Was not paying attention. Oops, don't die. Ow. Get me the fuck out of here! Now's your chance. It's, and it begins. Alright. So what really sucks is that uh, Yosuke and Teddy share the same weakness to lightning. And in this place, a lot of enemies love to use lightning. Right? So the moment you get Teddy, and if you're a new player to this game, you'd be like, Man, I really wanna, I really wanna play with Teddy on my team. Right? And then, uh, you realize that Teddy's getting his ass handed to him. You're like, oh. How dare you stand against me for being rotten orange? What? I'll make a worthless human like you taste endless pain. Take this! Critical hit! Punishing it. Mitsuo has been knocked down. Huh? No way, what the? <laughs> what the hell is this about? Anyways, we need to hurry on up. Alright. Oh shit! Dead end. That's not good. So I just wanna make it to the third floor. Just so we get the dialogue that pops up and stuff like that. I think it's the third floor that I went all the way to. Excuse me, coming through. Under level that shit, please. Alright. Oh, going through here. Hallways are really narrow. I mean, like, all the hallways in the dungeons were pretty narrow, but this one feels way more claustrophobic. I ain't got no wiggle room. <clears throat> Good morning. You seem to have slept well last night. You slept so well that not even noisy sirens from the police cars woke you. I think something real bad happened. Can you go buy some coffee from the cafe at the arcade? Thanks. Did you hear a girl was killed? It's becoming a dangerous world out there. I don't even feel safe walking around town. Don't let your guard down, and make sure you're not out late, okay? Hmm? Weird. There's a dead end up ahead. I thought this was the right way. Alright. So this is, as far as I went, <laughs> off screen, and now, just gonna load in the real file that we're gonna be using, which is this one. Went from, went from what, level 31 to 42? Yeah. I spent some time, spent some time, alright? <clears throat> so we won't get our asses handed to us. Alright. 
So here's where we're actually continuing from. The main changes that have happened is I've gotten some, uh, gotten some, I think I got some new personas, maybe. I didn't fuse any, I just kind of picked them up, I think. Uh, got this dude, he's been helping me kill the golden personas with physical attacks with Kill Rush. So I now have access to power charge, dodge physical, auto tear kajo, all that bullshit. If I ever want to, you know, use physical build, dude sitting right there. But we're going to end up fusing these guys anyways. Um, as for stats, Yosuke's now caught up to level 40. Pain in the ass, Yosuke. Right, Teddy's level 44. Yosuke is now has a uh, uh, Magarula. That's what I want. Um, mid level, what was it? Second tier win magic. So that's what Yosuke's got going for him. Kanji, that's what he's got going for him. And as for Teddy, this is what he got going for him. All right. So Teddy. It's a weird mixed bag of magic. Yukiko is mainly magic and healing, but mainly she's your healer, right? If you want a big old fire hit, you use Yukiko, right? But Teddy, Teddy's a little different. Teddy's, he, he's kind Yukiko ends up being the overall best healer, but when you get Teddy, cons uh, you know, if... If usually you get uh, Teddy at like a higher level than the rest of the crew, you know, if uh, if you're leveling up normally. Um, Teddy would come in with Meteorama, right? So he would be better than Yukiko at the moment. But later on, we're going to switch back to Yukiko and she's going to be way better than Teddy. But Teddy is more of a support character. He can learn uh, Materi Kaja, which boosts all our... Uh, physical, all our physical, all our attack, and he can also learn uh, Maruku Kaja, I think. So he also has Auto Ruku Kaja for himself, Ice Boost, Mabafula. For Ice Spells, you're gonna want Teddy, because Chie's never gonna learn, uh, she'll learn Bufudine, I think. Will she learn Bufudine? Oh, I don't think she ever learns Tier 3 Ice Magic now that I think about it. If she does, then it's just Bufudine. And she doesn't learn Mabu Fudine. But, um, Teddy's gonna learn Tier 3 Ice Magic. He's gonna have some situational shit, right? Teddy's just like this weird mixed bag of magic attack and support and a little bit of healing. But, uh, when you have him on your team, just keep in mind he shares the same weakness as Yosuke. So, keep an eye out for that. What the hell? I heard something in my background. That was kind of loud. But yeah. That's it for those guys. As for their equipment, nothing too crazy. This is just... I think the Paladin armor I found in like a golden chest or some shit. Um, yeah, so that's what you use Rocket. And then Yosuke, Yosuke, Kanji, and Teddy are rocking the same. Defense stuff. Teddy's using his default spiky punch. Uh, Kanji still has the desk that we gave him, and I think I, I bought kunines for Yosuke. So he can actually have something. Accessories, Volt Suppressor. Uh, awareness note, so we won't get uh, attacked from behind. And Bat Charm to increase Teddy's magic by 3, I think. Right? Yeah, increase magic by 3. And then we're using the uh, armband that we get from Nanako. Um, what else is there? No, nope, I think that was it. So what I'm gonna do? Oh, we got a shit ton of money too from uh from all the grinding, and this is before I sold my items. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head into the velvet room and start fusing some shit. Cause now that I am low 42, I would like to register these personas and have a persona that's about my level so we can beat the shit out of this dungeon um wait what am I doing I'm looking at command to <laughs> views search let's see 
So, if memory serves me correctly, I think the dungeon we're in right now mostly is like electric affinity. Come on, really? 43, one level away? And this is chariot too. This would be so good to have right now. It's not even funny. God damn it. I mean, I can hold off, right? I can hold off for one level. Ah, another one? Star. That's Teddy's stuff. Really? He stopped me at 43. Alright. I guess I'll just come back later. Now, I have yet to use the fox for any healing for myself. So, I managed to, I managed to grind and stick it out. Uh, I went to Rize's club to do it, and then if I ever needed some magic, I tried to like ride around and get some chests in Yukiko's castle, because that's where they have some snuff souls. So, I'm going to talk to the fox. Pat your head. Doesn't seem too upset. Alright. Give me some of that magical healing, baby. Excuse me? Fox, why are you taking all my money? What happened? You're not supposed to be taking my money like this, Fox. Why are you testing my patience? Look how much money he's asking for. Where's my discount, you little bastard? <laughs> when I checked earlier... You didn't, you didn't say this much. Alright. Gonna ran into a little bit of a problem here. I'm not spending that much for healing. Ain't happening. So, uh... Just gonna have to stick through it. Uh... Let's see. Yosuke, there you go. And Teddy, there you go. Hopefully that helps us. Damn it. Why you gotta fuck me, fuck me over like this, Fox? Maybe after doing that, you can... Ah, there we go. See, that's, that's why I like it. I feel like I should start running around Yukiko's place for like a hot second, grab some snuff souls. Or I can just spin it. Well, how much, uh... I got a lot of stuff here. Hmm. I'm a greedy bastard. I'm a greedy bastard. Take me over and chase the boy. That and my persona, High Pixie, is gonna um, help me. Oh, actually, what is your weakness, by the way? Weak to ice. Alright, that's good. I don't think there's that many enemies that use ice in this dungeon. Chapter 3. Alright. I'm just gonna send out an SOS. Still have yet received any help from the SOS system. Alright. So in this room, you head to these corners. And you're whisked away to a magical world. Look how small they are now. They're tiny teeny. They can't hurt us. Three enemies. I just gotta remember your uh Oh yeah, Rize levels up too, right? So now she has the treasure radar ability, which basically shows a star on the map uh, if we're near treasure. Also, just a quick warning. In the background, you can see that TV screen bugging the fuck out. Uh, if you have epilepsy or something, maybe don't look at that. Right? Uh, so what are you guys... Really? Trying to fire? Wait, are you shot in physical? No? Okay. Well, might as well just use physical. Someone else's turn. I'll get it next time. All right, get in there, Kanji. I want to get rid of those rocks first. Wow, literally, literally, I go. Not that many enemies that use ice magic. First thing, first thing you see is this guy. Oh, come on! Don't, don't go missing. 
It's not going down. Trying to preserve as much uh as much magic as possible right now. I'll get it next time. Cause that fox is being too goddamn stingy. I wasn't expecting that from you, Kanji. I Yosuke Senpai's persona is sealed. Eh, it's fine. Yeah, that's some thick skin. <laughs> Owie. I'll get it next time. It ain't going down. Oh shit. Come on, Yosuke, you got this. Good boy. Good boy, Yosuke. I'm gonna do this. I'm not really needing for uh XP at the moment. But I do need some of that good old magic. Alright. Oops. Um I'm trying to think if this is the area that I need to uh no, it's not. There's an area in this dungeon where you gotta go pick up an orb of darkness, I think. Because if you don't, then uh, you won't be able to progress. Alright. Three enemies on the field. Be careful. Ooh, three of them. What about you guys? Hmm, this Weak to ice? Hmm. I'm in preservation mode right now. It's so stubborn. Try my best not to uh hey, not, bad, Teddy. Keep it up. not to use magic when I don't need to. Oh nice job, Conjure. Don't get carried away. Oh, you block physical. That's not good. Right. Two enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. You got this Teddy. You gotta be fucking kidding me, dude. Enemy down. Just say the word and it's bear time. Fuck him up. It's show time. Are you ready? Perfect. Go. Perfect. Ew. <laughs> All right. Ah, oh, shit. There's another one. Huh? More enemies. Two to be exact. Weak to win, and wow, you're weak to, I guess, fire. Oh shit! Enemy down. Sensei, let me at him. Here I go. Good job, Teddy. Alrighty, take this and this. Lay down and die already. There you go. All right. Uh, eh, you can get him. It's not going down. One enemy to go. Keep it up. I'm pretty good, aren't I? Good job, team. All right. Um, uh, let me see. I think the doorway is this way. Preserve as much magic as I can. Either that or just blaze through it. I just don't want to spend full price. Near full price. To get recovered by the damn fox. Just gonna avoid you for now. <laughs> I might have to make a trip over to Yukiko's castle, which I kind of don't want to do. A female announcer draws near. Command, fight. Mitsuo attacks. Thou hast done well in defeating the female announcer. Mitsuo hath been promoted to thy next level. Thy excitement increased by four. Thy emptiness increased by one. This can't be. Does he mean murdering people was just a game for him? He's so on my enemies list. I don't think I want to be on that list, huh, Rizzo? Oh shit. What do you guys weak to? Electricity? Alright, I got this. Oh come on! What do you mean I missed? You're up. You hit the enemy's weakness. Now 
Now's our chance. Good answer. Is everyone ready? Get set. Yep, leave it to us. Go! Do not let them live. If the enemy has even a little bit of health, I'm gonna be angry. Damn it. Now that Yosuke isn't lacking behind by that much. Skill level up? Hmm, I'm thinking on it. Eh, skill level up, do it. Why not? Marakunda? I'll take it. You guys are weak to fire. The on the field. Be which, careful. which, technically speaking, I do have fire. I just don't have a multi-hitting fire. Which is why I don't want to, you know. Eh, fuck it. Why not? You a bow? <laughs> How much is Mamudo? 18? Hmm. What are your affinities to... Oh, shit. I don't know. You can win this. Eh, fuck it. Why not? Nice. Someone else's turn. Oh, come on. Of course you go for me. One enemy to go. Keep it up. These are my true abilities. All right, switch on back to High Pixie. Just holding out until level uh, what's gonna call it? Oh shit, that's a big boy. I don't want to fuck with that. I want that treasure chest, but not that, not that much. I have a bunch of keys that I can use. Four keys. What's in here? Chewing soul. Fuck yes. Thank you. Nothing of note in here besides little guy. Well, actually, I should be fighting you, honestly. <laughs> should be fighting you to get a little bit of experience. Ugh. Oh shit. There are four enemies. Keep your guard up. It's weak, weak to ice. Alright. Uh well. I have none of the sort, so. Of course! Of course you're gonna throw Makara Khan, jackass. This is my chance! How about it? Eh, you can go for it. That was good, Teddy. Keep it up. Jesus. Gee, it's like an endless stream of them. Wow! How cruel! Do something, Teddy. Our health is still looking fine. Famous last words. Hey, not bad at all. Get up. All right. Uh. Shit. Just heal us up, Ted. Damn it, Kanji, you really can't do much. <laughs> Shit. It's weak to wind. This'll be a breeze. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? I mean going for a kill rush, right? Lay down and dial. Damn it. Uh, who has Magaru? I think you do. Yeah. Gigan. Keep going, senpai. What? Oh shit. You're not weak to ice, damn it. Whoa, that was awesome, Yosuke 
Senpai? Teddy, wake up! Get a hold of yourself! Ah, shit. What did I do? What did I do to myself? It got back up. Defeat it back. Oh! Yusuke Senpai is dizzy. Here goes. Persona! Damn, couldn't finish it. Ah, fucking fuck, dude. Persona! There we go. Just say the word and it's go time. It's just me and Kanji. Is everyone ready? <laughs> Get set. Now we're talking. Yeah, go, go, go. Damn, Kanji. I'm going to get a lot for that. Oh, yeah, no, definitely. Hold up. Change persona. Lose an earned card. Half the XP. Damn it. I kind of want this, too. Change one to a persona. Nah, I'll go for the XP. Smarter move. A thousand? I'll take it. That was completely worth it. From a small little danky enemy. That's what happened. Nothing but craziness. Alright. Teddy. Actually, I shouldn't be telling Teddy to do it. I should be doing it. Because I can, uh... Because I can get my SP back. From High Pixie. Dump up. What the... Oh, there's a quick turn button? Damn. Learn something new every day. I didn't know that. Jesus fuck, not this again. Four enemies on the field. Oh no. <laughs> not this bullshit again. Uh-uh. Let's see. All right, Teddy. Me, me, it's my oh here shit! I, go. I didn't expect you to jump in like that, but good job. Three left. Just All right. Places, everyone, and action. Yes, go! Knock them out. Lay down and die already. Ooh! All right. I love how Yosuke basically just Wait. impales Teddy right there. <laughs> just sticks his hand through his heart. Nice work, guys. That was easier this time around. Take my ass upstairs. <laughs> a corpse discovered. Wait, what? A corpse discoverer draws near. Command. Fight. Mitsuo attacks. Thou hast done well in defeating the corpse discoverer. Mitsuo hath be been promoted to the next level. Thy sadness increased by five. Thy emptiness increased by eight. The next level? No way. Does that mean he's getting stronger? Senpai, be careful. This guy may be more dangerous than we thought. Be careful, Simpy. Simpy. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Yeah, no. Just gonna, just gonna say no to this. Fighting one of them would have been fine. Going with both of them? No goddamn... <gasps> Get over here. Can't escape me! Urgh. Man, you're a big boy. Ooh, a rare one. Don't let it get away. Yeah, I got this. Two enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. You got this, Yosuke. Damn, it's not going down. Teddy, poison skewer. Kanji back with the kill rush. Jesus. Summon who? It's calling back up. Hurry and defeat it. Uh. Uh oh. Oh, I don't know what they got planned. Oh, damn it. Damn, it's not going down. Four enemies left. Don't give up. 
Just adjust. Just adjust, Teddy. It's so stubborn. Here goes. Push it Lay down and die already. Oh, come on. Come on, kill rush. There we go. That's what I want to see. Rebellion? Oh shit. That's your plan. White wall, so you're weak to ice. Thanks. Thanks for letting me know, stupid. That's some thick skin. Teddy. Which one has the uh resistance on it? I think it's this one. Nice. Damn it! Kanji, come on, it's all you, buddy. Ash! Come on! Don't let it escape, don't let it escape. I don't care about your white wall, dog. No! So that's your plan, huh? Just, just fuck me over. That's some thick skin. Um, Yosuke Senpai, your health is really low. Who cares if his health is low? I'll get it next time. Come on, Kanji, I really need you here. Persona! Damn, couldn't finish it. Damn it, Kanji! Persona. Yes. Standing by. All right. At least we got one. Oh, of course, of course, of course you're resistant to physical. Of course. Life wouldn't be fair otherwise. Three enemies left. You can win this. It's not working. Hmm. Gonna switch over to high pixie. Um, hit you with Zionga. Eh, I'm still gonna have to deal with the other two, right? So, might as well just do this. Standing by, eyes reverted, white wall. You're really gonna make this difficult for me. All right, no problem. No way, it didn't work. Doesn't matter. Just hit him with ice, Teddy. Enemy defeated. Go for broke, Teddy. Uh, just get rid of you. You gonna run away? Sweet. Kind of expecting this guy to run away now. Unless I get a critical. Yeah, there you go. Alright. Well, at least now I know what to do with those two. Ooh, that's a lot. Something inside you has changed. You damn right it has. Torrent shot. Alright, deals medium physical damage. Oh, well, time to get rid of, uh... Oh. Two to three times. So instead of one to three times, two to three times. Goodbye, Kill Rush. Hello, Torrent Shot. That was totally worth it. That was worth expending all my goddamn SP. Okay, so, um... Gonna switch over back to High Pixie. And... Hey, looking, Ted. Alright. Enemy in here? Nope. Golden chest. 
soul food. Nice. Just gonna make it to the next floor so I can use a go home and head on back to the velvet room. Uh, this not this does not look good actually, Mazio. Never mind. Four enemies down. We can oh, Dan, it's showtime. Are you ready? Now we're talking. Yeah, go, go, go. I'm like stupidly hungry right now. Like more hungry than I should be. All right, I'll grab the skill card. Actually. Eh, half the XP, why not? Fuck it. Crazy chain. Still over that. Gotta get that wind boost for Yosuke. I think these guys are weak to ice, maybe. I think they're weak to ice. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? That's some thick skin. You are weak to ice. There you go. I would really like to get one of those chalices from like the cards, so I can get a little bit of SP back. Just a little bit. Shadow jump. God damn it. Two enemies on the field. Crush them. Jesus. Ooh, that's a little scary. Damn it. Jesus. Get up. I mean, it's a long shot, but. Nice job, Teddy. Teddy. Keep it up. Get that torn shot in there. Oh. I wasn't expecting that from you, Kanji. It was so beautiful. I'm gonna guard myself because you're power charged, and I'm kind of scared of you. Last one. Go for it. Oh, the other one was power charged. God damn it. Oh shit. Well, now I'm scared. Eh, Teddy, you're still at full health. You're expendable. Huh? I can't defeat it. Here goes. Push it on. Jesus, Kanji, come on, man. Someone else's turn. Come on, give me those chalices. Ah, damn it. Guess I'll just grab money. Can't go too wrong with money. Lifestone. Eh, I can use that. Let's see. I have seven lifestones. Revival beats three. Okay. Just checking my inventory. Alright. Oh wait, hold up. There's a chest over here. Come on. Don't mind me. Tesla coil, thank you. No. No. No! Huh? What now? Did he lose it? I don't know. But what I do know... So I'm just go home right now. Take my ass back to the beginning. Return to the entrance. Yes, please. How much you offering me, dog? You just really trying to bankrupt me. Oh wait, I kept reading that wrong. He's not asking for that much. That's in the five digits. Mine is in the six digits. You're actually asking for a pretty fair price. A 
I'll think about it, because I'm stingy. All right. Compendium, register. Because some of these guys leveled up a little bit. These personas. Chariot, 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 chariot. There we go. All right. Let's see. What are you gonna learn? Generate, well, what do you have already? Heat wave counter strike. And you're gonna learn regenerate, invigorate, dodge fire. What are your weaknesses? Weak to electricity. Hmm. Oh, before I forget, skill cards. Here you go. All right. Trying to see uh, if there's a version of it that I would really like to have. No. Da, 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 da. This one gets Guy again. Hmm. Mind Slice, Mirama. Oh. Well, you don't learn any of the magic shit. Which is kind of troublesome. Oh, now we're at Virtue. Alright. I guess this would be the best one, right? It's just that... It's that you really don't learn any magic. You would be stupid strong, but... You're really not going to learn any magic, which kind of makes me upset. What a... Shit. Alright, hold up. If I'm not learning any magic, I at least got to compensate for something. You're physical, which is, why I'm, which is mainly why I'm mad, because I can't use you in the fusion, because you got power charge. Uh, Hua has fire... You have ice and wind covered, yeah. Ice and wind. You have ice as well. Who has... Mm, 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 mm. See, that's the problem. That's the problem I'm having. If I get rid of, uh... My pixie, I won't really have my electricity no more. Alright. Alright. Um Yeah, I'll just I'll just do it. I'll just do it. Gonna give you. Well, I'm gonna give you these two. I know you're not gonna use magic that much, but I still want my goddamn invigorate. Uh, dodge fire is not really useful. Maruconda, that's pretty useful. And the rest, well, maybe media. Either for whole party or for me. I don't really like using Diorama that much, honestly. I don't like using the single healing stuff. I feel like if I'm doing healing, might as well just go for multiple people. Eh, I'll do Diorama. God, that doesn't sit well with me. <laughs> Jesus, I'm kind of mad about that. Don't fuck it up, Igor. Don't mess it up. Mm. 
Nice. Victory is in our hands. Alright, Marukukaja. Mustard Bomb. No Dizzy. I mean... Protects user from Dizzy. I mean, like... Medium to all foes with chance of blah blah blah. Eh. What's really weird is you don't have like a single attacking physical attack. That's weird. Yeah, no, I don't care about Mustard Bomb. Eh. <coughs> Excuse me. Blue Wall. Eh. I mean, like... Eh. Let's see, maybe I can get something better out of it. No. 45, which I don't, I don't have. Uh, da, 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 da. 42. Oh, now I get a 42. Mighty Swing. Recarum. 40. Genbu. 46. Oh, look at you. A moon. Really? Yami no to Orochi. Eh. Eh, I mean, wh all right. Let's see. I can fix this. Buy a skill card. What do we got? What we got in the physical department? Double Fangs, Rampage, Crazy Chain. Crazy Chain is all foes rage. Uh, deals medium physical damage to all foes. Light one to two times. Gale Slash and Kill Rush. I mean, I can just go for Kill Rush if I really want to. Invigorate. See, you should have told me that I just had Invigorate from the beginning. See, it wouldn't have been a problem. <laughs> All right, well, eh. Well, here's what's gonna happen. Here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna start fusing like crazy. See what we can get out of what. So, let's head on down to a, actually, there was a priest this one, right? Vati? Bunch of healing shit, Magaru, Bufula. Oh. What's your affinity? Weak to fire? No problem. Healing magic. Alright, I think I can work with this. Yeah. You're already gonna learn Meteorama. Counter Strike. Regenerate. Hmm. I'm trying to like plan it out in my head right now. I don't really need Counter Strike that much, but I would like to have. All foes are one foe. All foes are one. Well, I mean, I mostly use it for boss fights, honestly. Regenerate. Because I can just buy Invigorate. Yes. Get that Meteorama in there. 
Oh, she also learns Maruka Kaja by herself. Dodge Elect. Which I really don't need, honestly. I mean, what, what's this? Cures Exhaustion. Eh. eh. I mean, eh. Divine Grace, please give it to me. No, it's mine. I want it. Damn it. Alright. Pravati. Out of curation. Curation? Yeah, that's a word. Uh. Virtue. Hmm. Alright, no, I think I'm happy with Pravati, honestly. Da, 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 ba. Now, what matters is this. Let me just check what the hell you got again. Alright, you're rocking Ice, Wind, Regenerate, Maruka Kaja. I'm not worried about Maruka Kaja, honestly, and I can get rid of Diorama. Hmm, Diorama, however the fuck you pronounce that. So, replace that for Fire, replace that for Invigorate. And then all I would need is to get like a Zeo card or some shit, or have someone with electricity. Really, to be honest. So. Invigorate. I'm gonna buy that. I'm gonna buy Augie just to have fire. And then I would love to have electricity, but I do not have electricity. I'm gonna rotate these saves. Item. Uh. All right. Invigorate. Augie. Or an Agi? Yes. Uh... Nah. Oops. There we go. Make me very... Not the strongest, but make me pretty versatile. Pretty versatile. All I really need is someone with, uh... Electricity. I'm just gonna reorder my skills, because I'm gonna lose my mind if I don't. There we go. How much money do I have? Compendium. View. I would like to have High Pixie back, please. Thank you. That's the plan. That's the plan. Alright. How much are you asking for? Eh. It's not that bad. I'm greedy, so I'll still think about it. <laughs> I'm greedy. Ah, that good old soul food, baby. How much you want now? God, it's so cheap. God, I'm so cheap. Yeah, look at that. Back to full health, baby. Mm. 
That was a great exchange. All right. Preparation's done. Time to get back on in there. All right. I feel good about myself. Hey, it's you guys. What you got? You can do it. Well, encouraging you won't work because I. This is the same file that I used to. To uh, what you call it? To grind. So I ran into them before. Shadow. Hey, lifestone. For free. Thank you. Ah, shit. Here you come, the rain on my goddamn parade. Jesus. Uh, fire. Last one. Go for it. Wind. That's some thick skin. Jesus. Really? Nothing? It ain't going down. Damn it. Well, I'm not going to use physical on it because I'm going to assume it has Counter Strike. So just finish it off. Level up Persona? Fuck yes! Aha! Actually, I want Divine Grace, but what would I give up for that? Now that I think about it. I would give up Dodge Elect. <laughs> 100%. No hesitation. Oh, goodbye, sir. Have a lovely day. Hey, the stairs. Good morning. Did you sleep well? I heard that girl was killed last night. The noise of the arcade was bad, but can you buy some coffee from the cafe and the police cars? Wait, what? Did I read that right? Thanks. I can't even safely walk around. I can safely withdraw cash now. Have you heard? Good morning. Don't be out dangerously late, okay? Relax and don't let your guard down. Sounds like he's losing it. He might be insane. Mm, I'm getting kind of scared. And terrified you shall be. What? <gasps> it's this room. So, you're gonna run in the middle. The middle of the fiddle. And then it's gonna reorient. Uh, re, uh, re reorient. Fuck, I can't say the word. Reorientate you. So, what I like to do, sometimes if you just hug the side like that, it doesn't count. Really? You got me to a corner? Damn it. Dwee Now's your chance. Run! You feel smart now, don't you? <laughs> Enemy's like, I got him in the corner. Yeah, of course you do. Alright, so, what you want to do, I think you want to keep to the left side. Because this is where we pick up the Orb of Darkness, if memory serves me correctly. And just hug the side over here. Four enemies. Okay, I'll look for an opening. You better look for an opening. Just hang on. I'll find you an opening. Come on. Things are getting bad, Rize. Things are getting real bad. Rize? Senpai, your defense has been lowered. Now's your chance. Run! Thank you. Alright. Oh, there's totally a shadow in there. Oh, shit. Don't worry, I got this. Be careful. 
I may not have this. Ah, fucking bastard. Wind won't work, huh? Try something else. Oh yeah, I forgot you repel all magic because you're an asshole. Jesus. <laughs> senpai, that was so cool. Come on, Teddy. Yosuke Senpai, your defense is down. What the that was a Do it. spot. Good going, Teddy. What are you weak against? Oh, we don't know. Okay. Good going, Teddy. Keep it up. Kanji? Don't miss. It ain't going down. That's nah, fine. Enemy defeated. You're off to a good start. There we go. Skill level up. Don't mind if I do. Ah, turn to invade elect. That's nice. Love how they didn't instantly go for any of my magic. I'll go home. Thank you. You okay, Kanji? You seem low on health. Oh my god, he's not low on health. He's a little bit below half. There you go, he's fine. No, you stay over there. There's something beyond this door. Are you ready? You're damn right I am. Shadow approaches. That thing's weak to ice. Ruin its life. Enemy Go down. To town, nice senpai. Move, senpai. I just don't know what you're weak to. Uh, I'll try fire. Just All right. two left. Come on, this fight's not over. Damn, it's not going down. Of course. Eh. Twice the ice. Good going, Teddy. Keep it up. Here goes Persona. Lay down and die already. Persona. Kanji is so gonna fuck you up. Deathbound. Oh Not sh bad, Teddy. Keep it up. What's its problem? Don't give up. Incoming. Good job, Teddy. What the Dude, Dude, you're keep a beast. It up, Teddy. What the Good going, Teddy. Keep it up. Get him, Kanji. Oh, come on. Man, Kanji, you've been taking hints from Chie? That's what's going on over here? That should do it. Since when you start missing everything. Woo, well done. Are you okay, Senpai? Don't push yourselves too hard. Ah, we're fine. Teddy, we're fine, right? Yeah, we're fine. We're fine. Now make sure you pick this up. The Orb of Darkness, you're gonna need that. And now, I feel like I've spent way too much time in this area. Uh oh. Yeah. There are two enemies. Careful now. Okay, I'll look for an opening. Can you do it quicker rather than later? Just hang on. I'll find you an opening. Come on, they're sucking off Kanji. Two enemies left. Don't lower your guard now. Now's your chance. Run! Thank you. Alright. Now that I definitely feel like I've been here too long. Let's check the map. I'm gonna head all the way to the right side. That's where the stairs should be. 
So yeah, you can completely make it towards the end of this dungeon without picking up the Orb of Darkness, but you will not be able to progress. So you have to march your ass all the way back down here. No, you stay over there. Um... I'm gonna turn here. Oh no! Aha! Huzzah! <laughs> How dare you stand against me for being a rotten orange! Moroka draws near. Command, kill, run, kill. Mitsuo attacks! Thou hast done well in killing Moroka. Mitsuo hath be been promoted to thy next level. Thy attention increased by 16, thy fame by 17, thy coolness increased by 3. What's with this? All this about attention and fame. I can't believe this! Makes him think this is cool. Let's hurry, senpai. We gotta catch this sick bastard. Oh, yeah. Why are you so big? Why are you so strong? Get away from me. Now, the fun thing about Treasure Radar is that it means that once you see a star on the minimap there, you can just easily just assume that's just a room with a treasure box in it, so you can just avoid it. Helping you find the exit faster. Like this. Ah, the hero Mitsuo, thou hast done well. Your, your, your. <laughs> Senpai, we're closing in. Be careful. That was a fun noise that I made. I felt good making it. Oh shit! I was trying to see if I can just get it to turn around. Four enemies on the field. Fuck you <laughs> and fuck your Tetracarn, okay? And your Makara card. Now's your chance. Run. I love how the enemy started setting up all this bullshit, and I'm like, yeah, I'm just gonna walk away from that. All right. Treasure room. Goodbye. We don't need treasure no more. I'm making a beeline towards the uh, towards the boss now. In fairly good shape. Nope. Dead end. Two dead ends in a row. That's the first time I've ever seen that. I'm like really hungry. Jesus, fuck. Oh, what's with all these fucking dead end rooms? Oh, come on. I can't say no to that. Oh, I can't say no to this. Do I still have? Yes, I do. <laughs> Kill rush. Nice. Three of them. Don't give up now, okay? Power slot. I don't. I don't have any bombs on me, do I? Cast them on. Collect damage. Win. Ice. Ice. Fire. Yeah, no, I don't have any neutral bombs, right? I hold out, I reach out for the truth for my da 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 Damn, it's not going down. Alright. Uh poison skewer. I'll get it next time! Kanji, you got torn shot. Don't miss. It's all you gotta do is not miss. It ain't going down! Yeah? Yeah? Alright. If we can get two of them, I'll be super happy. I'll get it next time. Here goes. Ah, come on, Kanji. Damn it. Gale shot to all foes. Medium to all foes. Chance of exhaustion. I'll take my chance. Don't miss, don't miss, don't miss. Yes! Enemy defeated. You're off to a good start. Poisma? Jesus. Oh no, Teddy's poisoned. Going for big boy. That's 
some thick skin. Teddy is poison. That is pretty bad. It's okay, Teddy. Come on, this fight's not Don't fuck it up. Don't fuck it up, Kanji. Come on. Yeah! Oh, Damn, no. couldn't Teddy's finish it. poisoned. Damn it! Don't escape, don't escape, don't escape. Bash, I'll take it. Damn, it's not going down. Just two left. Come on, this fight's not over. Don't worry about healing, Teddy. What? I can't defeat it! Here goes. Come on, Kanji, I need you. Yeah! Kanji, that was great! You're the man! Oh, come on! Oh, shit. Yusuke Senpai's poisoned! Uh... Why'd I <laughs> click on Persona? Power Slash, Yusuke. Damn it! Yusuke Senpai! Someone heal him! Arr, against my better judgment. Come on, man! One, and One of them just needs to be a critical. Come on! Oh no, Teddy's poisoned. Let's do this. Just go for the skewer, Teddy. Think of the delicious payday that awaits us. Kanji, come on! You gotta hit this. Yeah, Kanji! Serves him right! Fifteen fucking thousand! Woohoo, Sensei! You're damn right! Alright, I leveled up! Another level! Gotta keep at it! I climbed the stairway to my. It's level up time! Jesus! <laughs> Jesus! That's a lot! That's a lot of damage. Oh, man. And I just need 400 after that, too. <laughs> oh, man. Yukiko and Chie, you are missing out on something delicious. That was hype as fuck. Alright, Teddy, you got us? And you know what? I got us. I got us, Teddy. Yeah, it's fine. Because... I should honestly be doing the healing because I, you know, my stuff automatically goes. Oh, I was getting a little worried there. Not gonna lie. I needed that. Aha! We're at the end. Perfect. Hmm, I can't sense him past this door. Open the door and enter? Yes. The door is sealed with a mysterious power. Huh? Pitch black darkness flows from the orb of darkness. Look! There he is! You, Mitsuo? You better be ready to pay, you bastard! Wait, Kanji! Something's not right. Everyone gets on my nerves! That's why I did it! What do you think of that? Say something, damn it! Oh no, it's attack of the Reddit slash Twitter people. <sighs> Nobody even thought of me after the first two people. That's why I went for the third one. I killed them! <sighs> what are you all quiet for? Because I feel nothing. What are you talking about? Make sense, damn it! What the? Which one's the shadow? I have nothing. I am nothing. And you are me. What? What's that supposed to mean? I'm... I'm not nothing! 
No, if this keeps up... Who are you guys? How'd you get in here? Damn it, who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Shut the hell up. We came after you. Are you the killer? <laughs> Ew. <laughs> That's a nasty laugh. <laughs> the fuck? Are you the killer? He's like... <laughs> of course I am. I'm the one behind everything. I don't give a damn what this imposter's saying. <laughs> you hear that? You have nothing to do with me. Get out of my sight. <sighs> goes for the rest of you too why'd you chase me all the way here i'll kill you i'll kill all of you i can do it you know i can do anything so you don't accept me <sighs> what the ah! oh no it's reddit's true form damn it here we go again Get ready, everyone. Or maybe it's that Pokemon fans. Once we beat him, this case is as <laughs> Nothing but a bunch of babies. <laughs> what? A new Pokemon game announced? Time to fucking... Time to complain about everything again. So, I like this fight, honestly. Mainly because of the music. It's all jaggy and blocky. Is that thing supposed to be a game character? Jeez, how insulting can he get? Jesus, a little uh, laying on it thick. Oh, there you go, okay. Is that supposed to be, what kind of graphics is this? Is this a PS2 game? You'll have to destroy the outer shell first. Yeah. So I really like this fight, mainly because A, the music is a Kind of a chiptune version of, uh, you know, of, uh, you, you know, uh, the battle music. And this whole entire fight is just a big old, kind of just, not Easter egg, but like, reference to, uh, to, uh, Dragon Quest. I like it. Oh shit, wrong persona. Pravati. So, what you want to do, you just got to beat the game character. It acts as a uh, outer shell for the baby inside. And then, once you get that baby out there, you're going to beat the ever-living shit out of it. Boom. Kanji is really great to have for this fight. So is Teddy, just to boost you up. This is why you love Kanji. Check this shit out. Damn! Owie! Owie! <laughs> nice dodge. I'm actually gonna switch. So I... Can have a good old big hit once you come out of that character. Hopefully, hopefully Kanji and Teddy can do enough damage to get you out of there. Oh shit! Yeah, come on, Kanji, don't fuck it up. Nice. Oh, come on. Yep, that has a chance of exhaustion. Yeah, they, they weakened him. He's not that weak, okay? I'm just gonna hold off on my big old attack. Now's our chance. You ready? All right. Out of our way. All right. So. When Mitsuo's out of his, uh, well, Shadow Mitsuo, when he's out of his little shell, he's gonna start, uh, doing some crazy shit. So, let's just going for some damage. 
in Yosuke's senpai. All right. Here goes. Crush it time. Damn it. All right, blue wall. Now, who's weak to ice? I'm trying to remember what it is. It's either when he puts up the resistance, that means he's going to use that type of magic, or he'll use the opposite of that type of magic. I think it means he'll use that type of magic. And honestly, I don't think anyone here is weak to ice. Unless it's my persona. Yeah, okay, it's my persona, which doesn't really matter, because I can just, bam, do that. Yeah, but once he, uh... Once he starts putting up that fucking resistance, you want to start blocking. Whoever's weak to whatever. Yosuke has... Yosuke's tired. And I'm trying to think, should I just attack and... No, you know what? Do I have one that's just for one ally? Cures poison. Barrier. Oh, well. Damn, Yosuke. Guess you're just gonna have to deal with losing magic then. They've weakened Yosuke Senpai. I'm gonna do this, mainly for Kanji. And I think I still have my, uh, my, what you call it, my power shit going on. Here goes. God damn it, Kanji. Oh. Yosuke Senpai. Oh, man, oh, man. Teddy, are you okay? Someone heal him. Yikes. Yosuke Senpai is injured. This is bad. You know what I just realized? <laughs> My bad, he used blue wall, right? Blue wall is for electricity. Not for ice. White wall is for ice. God damn it. I'm an idiot. I mean, you, you okay there, Kanji? Don't nah, strain fine. yourself. It's fine. We're all fine. I still got my power charge going. Don't fuck it up. Really? Guys, you're really low on health. Damn it. <laughs> Alright, well here's what's gonna happen. Cause he's definitely gonna go for that again. I should have paid attention more. <laughs> should have paid attention more. Um where is it? Magic mirror. Oh, that's for one ally. Well, I mean the only one that's really weak against it is Teddy, so. There you go. Staying the air is annoying. That's mainly for when he starts using his bombs. Now, what you want to do is do enough damage. The shell takes time. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, Rize. You want to do enough damage to stop him from doing this shit. Uh, I'm gonna switch on back over. Just so I can provide some healing. Really need to pay more attention. That shouldn't have happened. Uh, I'm not that worried though. Where the fuck is my revival bead? There you go, Yosuke. Get on up. Kanji, stop him. Damn it. Ah, shit. Of course you got hit with fear. Honestly, Mitsuo is not that hard of a fight. I just fucked up royally. 
Bam. Paralyzed with fear. Ghastly whale. Yeah, I royally fucked up. <laughs> My bad, Kanji. I'm sorry. There you go. Just say the word and it's bear time. All right. Let's not fuck around no more. Um. Here goes. Yeah, just go for torn shot. I'll have uh. I'll have Teddy heal us up. Oh shit. Alright. Well, if that's the case. Trying to eke out a little bit of damage before you fully revert back in there. This is mainly so that Kanji don't die. Torn shot. Get as much as you can, Kanji. There you go. That's the one I'm worried about. Ooh, that's not good. Oh, that's definitely not good. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Just gonna... He gets Ghastly Whale on, and if he hits you with that, uh, Deathbound or whatever the fuck it is, you're done. When you hit with this status. So I'm just gonna... Say no to that. Ba -da 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 -da. And with this turn, we should do enough damage to get him out of there. Not this turn, but this round. Kanji? There you go. Just say the word, and it's go time! Ah, Dan, ready! Yeah! Red wall. Who's weak against fire? That's not me, right? I'm not weak against fire. Oh, I am weak against fire. Oh! <laughs> I'm actually gonna switch Persona then. Um. Oh, well, let me show you. Uh, whoever's weak against whatever element he's using, if you guard... Oh, wow. It doesn't do it in Golden. In fucking, uh, whatchamacallit, in Persona 4 Vanilla, like the original version, when you guard <laughs> whoever was weak against whatever he was using, the fucking camera would flip upside down like it was goddamn Prince of Bel-Air. But, you guard. That's what you do. And then everyone else attacks. Oh shit, Kanji might actually be in trouble a little bit. Yeah, and that's how you deal with this bullshit. Right? So he'll use the element, whatever the fuck, whatever resistant he puts up, he's gonna use that element, and you just block with whoever's weak to that. I should stay blocking, honestly. But I'm not gonna do that, so... Actually, you know what? I'm gonna keep this persona up, because I want that divine, um... I want that divine grace, so I'm just gonna. You okay there, Kanji? Don't strain yourself. Ah, uh, Kanji's fine. Oh, he doesn't have enough to pull off the torn shot, though. Wait, you got a. Here you go. Let's do this. Persona. Sorry. Ah, oh, don't apologize, Kanji. It's just me being stupid. Hmm. Yeah. 
Damn, Kanji. That's why we love you. Aw. Not my not my stats. Come on, Yosuke! Jesus. Should I just go for it? Eh, what's the worst that could happen? As long as nobody fucks up, we're fine. As long as no one fucks up, we're all fine. Shut up, Rize. I got this. So there you go. Just say the word and it's bear time. Gotcha. And with that, we have defeated all of Twitter. Ooh, congratulations! All right, I leveled up. I almost got wind boost. God damn it! Finally awake, huh? You've been a major pain in our ass. What the? You guys? Who the hell are you guys? We came to capture you. Came to rescue you. I'm capturing your ass. The police are after you. They think you're the one who killed King Moron and the other two. So, are you the killer? Come on, Yosuke. The man's dead. Can you just call him Moroka? All the cases. All on me. <laughs> That's right. I did it. You piece of shit. And not just that bastard Moroka. That stupid announcer! And the Konishi bitch, too! I killed all of them! It was all me! Huh? Where'd it go? I don't know. Let's just be happy it's not a persona and that you're not joining my team. What's going on? <laughs> it's gone. That frickin' monster disappeared. Take that, son of a bitch! <sighs> Hey! He's exhausted. We need to hurry and get him out of here. I don't know, we can just leave him to the shadows. I see no problem with that. Where am I? Can't you tell? Why am I here? What the hell are you guys? S stop it! Why did the TV... Hey. You seem confused from everything that happened, but we have a bunch of questions for you. First off, why did you do all this? Answer in ten words or less. What the fuck, Teddy? <laughs> what the hell? Is that a costume? <laughs> what a loser. Get out of my face, you freak. F freak <laughs> Hold it, Teddy. You're not helping. Hmm. Are you the killer? Did you do it? Get off my back. I already told you. I did it. Why? How could you do such a thing? Three people are dead because of you. Everyone's talking about it, right? It's a huge deal. And I did it. All of it. All by myself. You just wanted the attention? Then why did you target me and the others? How did you kidnap us? <sighs> Whoa, look who it is. <laughs> hey, Yuki. After all this time... Now you want to talk to me? <laughs> what bullshit. <laughs> My god, um, damn it. Fucking, this, the most unlikable character. Answer me. If you held a grudge against me, that's fine. But why the others? 
<laughs> what a joke. You're so desperate it hurts. <sighs> I didn't care who I attacked. Everyone pisses me off. You what? Gotta be kidding me. You killed Senpai over nothing? You son of a bitch! I hope you're ready to get what's coming to you. <laughs> what, are you gonna kill me? Kanji-kun! Kill you? It ain't gonna be that easy, you piece of shit. What you did can never be taken back. No, you're gonna own up to your crimes and pay for what you did. You ain't gonna be allowed to kick the bucket until you understand exactly what it is you've done. <sighs> Damn, Kanji. Why, damn it! Why does she have to die because of this bastard? <laughs> Dude, the cops. Huh? What are you waiting for? Call the damn police! Yeah, you're right. Yosuke. Listen, I get that the whole fact, right? They made Mitsuo to be the most unlikable guy. At least Adachi san seemed happy. He ever fucking came across. And it works. But I'm mad that I hate him. I'm mad that I hate him because he wants you to hate him. <laughs> and he wins. I hate that he wins. <laughs> well, I guess this means our work is done. He did it all to draw attention. Wow, I can't get my head around that. It's just wrong. Hey, don't worry, Che. Give it like a couple of years and then fucking... What's, whatchamacallit? Snapchat will be invented. Instagram. All that shit. <laughs> and then you'll learn what people do for attention. I mean... Not that it would have been okay if he'd had a better reason. I know. Don't worry. It's finally over. Let's leave the rest to the police. My world will be peaceful again now. Yeah, I'm happy for you. We really went through a lot. I like scoring with guys. Jesus! Oh, come on, will you ever let it go? Damn! What? Scoring with guys? Kaji wasn't there with us. You don't need to know the details. I'm sure you'd like us to forget the sauna incident too, right, Kanji-kun? Oh. Uh, well. That's not fair. I wanted to see everyone else's too. That's right. We three are the only ones who saw everyone's secret. We three? Oh yeah, me, Yosuke, and Teddy. Jesus! Hey, so what was Yosuke's like? Come on, it's about time you told us. Oh no, so Yosuke's was pretty sad, dog. I don't remember much. Come on, let's leave it at that. Speaking of which, nothing really happened in your case, huh? Really? Wait, really? Is there something special about Senpai after all? Sensei is the man. You're damn right I am. And now that the case is solved, we won't be calling you leader anymore, will we? Oh yeah, it's kind of sad. Hey, why don't we have a celebration? We always have a rap party after we're done shooting. It's fun and it'll help give us some closure. Ooh, a party, that sounds great. Let's go all out. Oh, oh, I want to go to Yuki-chan's house. Gorgeous dinner, hot springs, table tennis, yukata, geisha, Fujiyama, full wootness! Wootness? You're right. Yukiko Senpai's family runs a hot springs inn. A hot spring that Yukiko Senpai bathes into? What the fuck, Kanji? Hey, keep it to yourself. You're sounding like a creep. Well, it sounds like fun, but I don't think it's possible today. Yeah, it's summer vacation. All the rooms must be occupied. We can't do a sleepover? Maybe next time. I promise. Hey, why don't we hit your place instead? Oh, 
but will your uncle get suspicious? Like, why are you all celebrating? No, yeah, just say exams. Eh, no problem at all. Then it's settled. Nanako-chan can join in too. You damn right she can. Oh yeah. If your uncle's a detective, he might not come home tonight. Nanako-chan might be getting hungry. I'm fucking hungry. Hey, then why don't we make dinner together? Why why don't you don't? How about that? Wow, are you good at cooking, senpai? Well, sort of. What are you saying? Did you already forget the tragedy of the school camp out? Well, we already told you that was an accident. She's right. We just got a couple of the ingredients wrong. Guys, please don't do this. I'm begging you. I don't need another trauma to deal with. Hey, I'm a good cook, too. I'll make something for you, senpai. Oh, you will, will you? Ta-da! Teddy has a great idea. Let's have a cooking battle. The winner will be crowned Iron Cook Inaba. A cooking battle? Now I'm even more worried. Sure, that sounds like fun. Aw, but I'll win hands down. You sure you want to make it that easy? God damn, Rize. Dude, listen to me. For the sake of our stomachs, you have to cook something too. Help us, partner. You're our only hope. Then you can represent the guys team. Nanako-chan will be our judge. I can be a taster too. Teddy can be a tester too. At the end, you're supposed to say that was delicious, right? Woohoo! I'm getting all fired up! All right, let us advance forth into the grocery section downstairs. Charge! This is the worst idea we ever came up with. June has groceries department. You decide to call Nanako to tell her about the cooking competition. John, what she wants for dinner? What do I want? Um, anything's fine. She's just being modest. Ask her again. Well, um, an omelet. I want to eat omelet with fried rice. Really? Just eggs and rice? Nothing, you know. What about chicken marsala? Something like that. I can cook that up for you. Make it with a little bit of sangria. You ended the phone call. Nanako seems to be looking forward to it. Fried rice omelet. An excellent choice, Nanako-chan. What the fuck you mean excellent? Oh, yeah. It's pretty simple that these two can't fuck it up. With a dish that simple, I doubt we'll get a second helping of Mystery Food X. Huh? What's wrong? N nothing All right. Let's go get our ingredients. Why'd you stutter? Where are you going? Uh, if they're all making the same thing, why are they splitting up to different parts of the market? Looks like you'll need all the help I can give you. I don't need your fucking help. Hey, what kind of omelet are you making? I'll go get the ingredients for you. Alright, so the type of omelet you choose doesn't really matter if memory serves me correctly. But I think Nanako's favorite one is actually, uh, the ketchup flavor. I guess because, you know, kids love ketchup. I don't know. The sweetness of ketchup. Now, of course, of course, if it was me, myself, I would choose Meridian style. But whatever. Meridian. Yes, I called it Meridian. <laughs> Orthodox ketchup flavored. Gave Yosuke a list of ingredients you'll need. Everyone bought their basic ingredients to the cart. Foie gras? Quite an eye you got there, senpai. It's a must-have for my special omelet. Don't worry, I'll let you have a taste. Ooh, or maybe I could spoon-feed you. 
I heard last time you choked down something so awful that words couldn't describe it. It was horrible. You poor dears. Who would do such a horrible thing? Rise-san, this is going to be the only chance you get to gloat. Is that clear? I'll crush you with one strike. Jesus. Whoa, you guys look like you're ready to enter the ultimate frying championship. Kanji-kun, that's alcohol. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> I love how he thought he was slick. Wait, where's Teddy? You're like Kanji, that's fucking alcohol. He's like, oh, it is. <laughs> Miss, am I allowed to eat this? Of course you can, dear. Eat as much as you like. You're such a nice lady. Is this one cooked already? <laughs> This one's ready, too. Oh, my. Are you hungry for more? Here, I'll open this one, too. You're so beautiful. Oh, my. No. No, I mustn't. I've got a husband and a son. But I really want this meat. And I want you to cook it, miss. What the fuck? Oh, I couldn't possibly. The manager would get so upset. I'm gonna knock the stuffing out of that bear. Hey, calm down, Yosuke. Don't get mad because he's getting some and you're not. Oh no, I have a husband and a son. But I want this meat and I want you to cook it. <laughs> oh god. What the fuck, Teddy? Risei Chan was right. This celebration does make me feel like it's over. The case really has come to an end. <sighs> It's really Risa-chan! I should go back over there soon. Are you going somewhere? Yep. The guys kept their promise. A promise? Huh. What if you made a promise with me? Could you stay then? A promise with Nana-chan? Um... I promise that you'll play with me. How about that? Sensei, you kept your promise with me, so I should go back over there. Eh, don't worry about it. But a promise is a promise. It's not good to break them. Ah, but you promised Nanako, didn't you? Sensei! I promise with Nana-chan. I made a promise to play with her. Can I really stay here? It wasn't just my promise. Nana-chan made it with me. I'm really, really happy. You better cherish that goddamn promise or I'll kill you, Teddy. Thank you. Teddy's eyes are watering. Teddy's social link has reached four. Teddy has learned Rikarum. Uh, what would I get rid of for Rikarum? Energy shower? Energy shower. Yeah, I think it's time. Goodbye, energy shower. Yosuke, I have a new promise to keep, so I want to stay here a little longer. Is that okay with you, sir? Sir? Huh? What are you talking about? You're not going anywhere. You can't just quit your job like that. In any case, if you left... It's ready! Incoming food! Out of the way, senpai! Jesus! Whoa, ow! Bon appetit! Well, well, wait a sec. Asking Nanako-chan to jump in and try these for us is kinda... unethical. <laughs> unethical, immoral, pretty dangerous, hazardous, even. Don't look at us like that! Oh... 
So it's our job to taste it first, to make sure we can keep it down. Hey, that's mean! <laughs> then try mine first, Yosuke-senpai. It's guaranteed delicious! You don't mind me going first? Actually, I've been looking forward to yours. I mean, Rizette cooked it herself. Can you imagine how many guys would kill me if they found out? Well then, chow time! I... I... can't give this to Nanako-chan. Ooh, it's so delicious that you won't let anyone else have a bite? In any case, you should try eating it too. Yeah, why not? It's spicy! The spiciness and heat are like lava in your mouth. What the hell? You can't taste or feel the foie gras at all. It's starting to taste like iron for some reason. You sense, you sense a dull pain in your mouth as well. You can't give this to Nanako. <laughs> I'm sitting there like fucking Idris Elba on the fucking hot ones where he's eating the spicy wings and he's like, fuck! Here, try mine next. Don't kill me, Yukiko. I'll take this one. K Kanji, that's a lot. Alright, Kanji, what the fuck, man? Hey, say something. Well, uh... How do I put this? It tastes really... Um... Boneless? <laughs> Make that shit boneless. What? That's not a word you use to describe taste. Does it taste good or not? T oh shit, I didn't mean to skip it. Let me taste this myself. Oh, it doesn't seem to be dangerous, but you don't sense any flavors in particular. In fact, you don't taste anything at all. You can't even taste the ingredients. How could this be? So what you're telling me is tastes like the uh, McDonald's McRib. All that goddamn barbecue sauce, but you eat it and somehow it tastes like nothing. Not good, uh, that's for sure. It tastes like... Like I'm eating plain oatmeal. It's pretty impressive that you put so many ingredients into a dish and it came out tasting like nothing. <laughs> Shit. Your palate just isn't refined enough. I think it tastes good. <sighs> Nanako-chan. <sighs> okay. Try my next. All right, Chie. Uh... I don't know about this, but I think it'll taste good. This time for sure. I'll give it a whirl. How is it? Wow, this tastes awful. Fuck does that mean, Teddy? You have to try this, Yosuke. Dude, not after you say that. Aha. Uh -huh. I see. Let me try some of that. Oh, it does taste awful. Oh, he wasn't well, wrong. Um, it's a huge improvement over the curry. At least no one died. Yeah, thanks for the consolation. I feel so much better. I think this tastes good too. Why'd you stutter, Nanako? Nanako-chan! Oh yeah, they're right. They're totally right. It tastes awful. <laughs> Jesus. A little cold-hearted there. Then try Rize-chan's! I bet you anything mine tastes better than hers. Sure enough. One strike. Well, Yukiko and Chie's didn't taste good either, but at least theirs didn't cause any casualties. <laughs> I think Yukiko's the winner, right? It's a taste too subtle for kids. It's a mature flavor. You guys are just kids. I... I... <laughs> 
Way to go, Yosuke. <laughs> it, it's spicy, but it's still good. Nanako had to rethink her life for a moment. Nanako-chan. Hm, I knew it. Nanako-chan's the most mature person in this room. Crocodile tears. Oh, yeah. Didn't you make one too, senpai? You damn right I did. It's the fancy looking one. Yep, it's good too. It seems to have come out pretty well. She's eating it cheerfully. Nako, finish your omelet. Are you full, Nanako chan? We're still starving. If you're so hungry, then help yourself to an awful tasting omelet. <laughs> What the fuck, Chick? How you be mad at him if you made it shit? Uh, I have a suggestion. Order pizza? You guys know about the festival they're holding in the shopping district, right? Why don't we all go? Oh, that sounds good. Whoa. Does that mean the girls will be wearing yukata? A festival? We'll bring Nanako-chan along, too. I can come? Of course you can come. If you weren't able to come, then I would kill all my friends right here. That settles it then. Festival food always tastes great for some reason. Even if it ain't anything fancy. Whew. We'll finally be able to get some edible food for once. Damn, Kanji. <laughs> you promised the others that you go to the festival at the shopping district. The culprit has finally been caught. The rest is up to the police. The festival starts on the 20th. You made sure not to forget about this date. You're damn right I won't. Would you like to save? Uh, yes, please. I'm almost level 50, Jesus. All you can do now is wait for the police to make their move. What should you do today? I don't know. Alright, let me see what my stats are, actually. Oop. Uh, what's the button? Here we go. Alright, I'm Professor, Brave, Strong, Generous, Touching. Touching. I think I still gotta get my expression up, right? For Nanako and, um, Dojima? And since we uh, just done uh, the what call it the dungeon, we can hang out with the team. Should really start hanging out with Kanji though, right? Head into town, see what we can do. Uh, shopping district. And I can't really progress the uh, the Emma request because I need school to be back in session. All right, so let's check the social link. Yukiko, Yosuke, oh, Yosuke's at 8? Jesus. Huh. Rize's at 1. Poor Rize. <laughs> Fox is at 6. Young Mother, I, been ignoring I. Dodgy's at 6. Marie, oh shit, we gotta start hanging out with Marie. Speaking of hanging out with Marie, let me see, does she have a new poem for us? Oh, well, she's right there. Um. Hmm. Do I even fucking have the personas that I need? Let's see. Oops. Your priestess. Strength. I don't really need strength right now. Magician. Hanged. Don't really need hanged. Emperor. I need Aeon. Chariot. Star. Priestess. I got two priestess. But I'm using those. Um. I need a lovers. you damn right I'm going in. Compendium. Register. Boom. Alright. Give me... A... I'm gonna need justice. And hero font. Pretty sure I pass hero font. Uh, hero font, hero font, hero font. Yes. Oh, I don't have a lovers in my compendium? 
That's not good. What can I do? Hero lovers. Hmm. Undyne? Queen Mob. Is there like one that doesn't involve three fucking personas to make? Jesus. Ah, you gotta be kidding me. Alright. Queen Mob. Which means... Oh wait, here it is too. Angel and uh, Amino, Uz Amino Uzumi. Um... Yeah, it doesn't matter what abilities you have. Invigorate. Come on. Boom! Don't fuck it up, Igor! I'll kill you! Good. Alright. Uh, sure, why not? Alright. Head back to the compendium real quick so we can grab... Angel and Uzumi back. Where the hell's Angel? Alright. Um. Don't need anything for Moon, Sun, not really worried about right now. Devil, haven't been doing it. Hanged, death, death, we sh I should honestly start doing death, but I need to hang out with devil first. Eh, whatever. Alright, priorities. Who will I prioritize right now? We can hang out with Marie, I'm not worried about Chie or Yukiko right now, or Yosuke. Kanji. Kanji. Can I hang out with Kanji? It's between Marie, Rize, and Kanji. Can't even hang out with Kanji. I'm gonna... I'm gonna prioritize Marie. Because now that we have enough characters in our party, we don't have to... Oh, shit. Before I forget. Before I forget. All that grinding I did has to pay off. Take my money, damn it. I mean, take my money. Take my shit. Give me money. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay. All right. I'm so fucking rich. <laughs> yeah, that's that's a good amount of money. What's in here? Nothing. All right, Marie, hang out with me. Check on the dwellers. Marie. Huh? Yeah, I'm gonna take you somewhere. I'm gonna take you for a ride. Let's go. Let's go. Um. Hey, can I see a school? You're gonna- you're going to one, right? I wanna see what it's like. Sure, why not? Let's hit the school. Let's hit the school during summer vacation. Can we do that? Simagawa Floodplain. You decided to take Marie to school with you. Hey. You go to school every day, right? You don't get tired of it? Of course I get fucking tired of it. It's pretty much my duty. Eh, I skip sometimes. Oh. Hmm. Don't look at me like that! But you don't come to that room often enough. What are you, my fucking wife? You stupid moron, I hate you. That's why I hate playboys. But it seems that Marie wants you to take her out more often. What's up? Hey, partner, what you doing? Oh, hey, Marie John. It's been a while, hasn't it? I heard that you've been with Chie and Yukiko, so you're showing her around, huh? What are you guys doing? Out on a stroll? Showing her to the school. Huh? You are. You tell Yosuke how Marie wants to see the school. Oh, I get it. Marie-chan goes to a different school after all, huh? Uh, still. 
What's so special about our school? It's special because it's out in the sticks, and it's made out of fucking plywood. Oh well. Alright, I'll join you. Allow me to welcome you to Yosagami High. Can I go inside? No problem. There's some committee meeting today, so the gate could be open. Should be open. <laughs> I mean, we can always say that we're showing you around the school. During summer vacation. Alright. <laughs> Just got me high, second floor. And here's our classroom. <laughs> Pretty retro, huh? I guess you could call it cozy. Or splintery. It's so big. Huh? It is? Well, there's a lot of empty land here. I guess the school's pretty big if you count the fields and yards and stuff. What about where you are, Marie? Is it cramped, since it's the city? Me? It's tiny. I mean, it's a single room. For reals? One room? <laughs> For reals? For serious? Is it, uh, some kind of advanced placement class or something? I don't know. It's small, it's dark, the nose never says anything, nobody ever says anything. It's boring. The nose? Is that, uh, what you call your teacher? Hmm. A teacher who doesn't talk. Isn't that neglecting your job? Hey. Hey, I want to see more. There's still more to see, right? Seems Marie's very interested in your school. She's a strange one, huh? <laughs> then again, everybody's gotten everybody I've gotten to know recently has been pretty much on the odd side. What the fuck does that mean, Yosuke? Wait! You fucking asshole! I wonder why Saki didn't like your ass. Everybody I met has been moving kind of funny. Like what? And this is where we hang out. <laughs> What do you think? Isn't this a great place to spend your youth? No. Youth? How does someone spend youth? Give me an example. An example? Hmm. Well, you know, building friendships, sharing your concerns, confiding in each other, stuff like that. It's kind of awkward to have to put into words. Wait. That's awkward to put into words, Yosuke, but walking up to someone being like, wouldn't you like to spend your youth here isn't awkward at all? What? Alright, you fucking weirdo. I don't get it. Do green and red do that too? Yeah, you spend it with everyone. Yeah, of course they do it. Why? Why do you need to spend youth? Don't you have anything better to do? That kinda hurts. <laughs> you want me to say more? Uh, well, I mean it's fun. Not being in superficial relationships, being with the people who know the real you. The real you. Being with people like that helps keep me from losing sight of who I am, you know? So I can face myself. Ugh, this is embarrassing. I can't say anymore, sorry. Face yourself. Huh, wondering about your true self? Let's spend our use together, Marie. No. What? No? I guess I won't take you out the fucking room no more. What good is it gonna do anything? Marie's in deep thought. Let's just send it here. Please forget I said anything. So, uh, I know. You haven't seen the library yet, right? We don't have all day, so let's get going. Face your true self. Seems Maria is wondering about the meaning of what Yosuke said. You feel like you understand Maria a bit more now. Rank 4. Let's go. See ya. After showing Maria around the school with Yosuke, you escort Maria back to the Velvet Room. Welcome back. Welcome back yourself. Well... 
Never mind. Seems Nanako's hiding something. But with your current level of expression, doesn't seem you'll be... Okay. I need to be enthralling. Cool. Uh, what do they have going on at Aya's tonight? Head on back to the shopping district. Da 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 ba da da ba. Steak bowl? Increase my understanding. Hmm. I want to get my expression up. Is the only way to get expression up through, like, books and fucking... And, like, working? If I had the speed reading book, I would probably, you know, use that for expression, but fuck it. I might as well just make money, right? Bam. Translate. You can do it. Some of the idioms in the text made your translation work different. Difficult. I got 4,000. All you can do now is wait for the police to make a move. Alright. Oh, shit. Uh, shopping program. What do you got for me, Tanaka? Hmm. And giant candy, okay. Smart bombs, too. And supersonics. Supersonic. And I'll just take the... Accessory. I don't know what it does, but I'll take it. Bam. Alright. See you later, Nanako. I'm gonna go waste my time outside doing something. Right now, I'm trying to think. The next dungeon... Who will I be bringing with me? Hmm. Want to prioritize Marie, like I said. Huh? It's going to be more difficult to hang out with her later, so might as well do it now. It won't deepen just yet. Yeah, because I chose all the wrong choices. Let's go. <laughs> just waste a day hanging with Marie. Not do anything special. Just chilling. Having a fun old time. Welcome back. Can't even hang out with Nanako. <laughs> Cause my expression's not good enough. I can't express myself. Translate. Besides work on translating. Had a hard time translating. Encounter a sentence that's meant for children. Properly translate it. Sentence lost his charms, but you achieved your goal. Eh. Damn it. Haven't seen Dojima in like fucking three days, man. Where is this guy? He's out there doing police work. Alright. It's cloudy today. It's cloudy outside. Glad it with a chance of shmeat balls. I never actually watched that movie. Don't know if it's good or not. Can't hang out with Marie today, but I would love to hang out with Kanji if I could. I know I'm bringing Kanji to the next dungeon. Damn it, Kanji, where are you, man? Did I hang out with? I hung out with Kanji, right? Oh no, oh no. No, 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 no! Damn it! That's not good. I didn't unlock Kanji's, uh. I did not unlock Kanji's, uh. Social link. I think I was too busy focusing on Yuki and, uh, Chie. And I think you can only unlock a social link when you're in school. Because I talked to the girl, right? I talked to the girl at, uh... The girl you talk to. She tells you about Kanji and the whole bullying thing. And then, um... 
After that, I'm supposed to go and talk to Kanji, but fucking damn it. Maybe he'll appear out here somewhere. Maybe I'll be able to hang out with him then, see if that works. And Rize's not even out here. Am I bringing... Who am I bringing with me to that next dungeon? I think it's going to be Yosuke, Kanji, and Yukiko. Yeah, I think, I think that's the team I want to go with. Junez. Yosuke, you out here? You're damn right you are. Yo! <laughs> Hang out with me, Yosuke. All right. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Two dudes hanging out, watching a movie, holding hands, maybe kissing out a little bit. Spent quality time with Yosuke. You damn right I did. Oh. Gonna unlock some, some uh, awakened personas. Real soon. If Marie's not hanging around. Come on, expression. Encounter the joke. What do you do? Make up a joke that fits. I'm a funny guy. Haha. -ha. Your pace has increased. You now got a lot of that schmingle schmingle in your pocket. Head on outside. Alright. Back into town. Marie? Are you ready to hang out with me now? Is Kanji walking about? Can I speak to him? Marie doesn't want to hang out with me. She hates me. She hates me now. Kanji? Yeah, I highly doubt Kanji's ever gonna show up. Uh, I might have fucked that up. Might have fucked it up. What about Yosuke? Come on, Yosuke. Hang out with me, Yosuke. Alright. Everybody hates me now. That's great. <laughs> Won't show up unless his link is started. Yeah, I was afraid of that. <laughs> I was afraid of that. Hey, Yukun. I feel kind of embarrassed. Do you want to go somewhere? I don't know, Yukiko. You seem like you're kind of in heat. You're scaring me a little bit. Oh, that reminds me. I found out you're only allowed to go 60 kilometers. Kilometers? Am I saying that right? No. Fucking metric system. God damn it. God damn it. Me and my stupid American brain. And now we're on a scooter. Or was it 30 an hour? Either way, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter, girl. Yes. Head to my room. Let's hang out. Damn it. I was hoping maybe by some stroke of luck, since I talked to the girl in the school building, that maybe Kanji would show up. Right? Damn it. I fucked that one up. Royally. Welcome home. Hi, Nanako. I wish I could hang out with you, but I'm not entertaining enough. So I just gotta keep translating. Damn it. No Emperor until September. No, you can do Emperor before that. It's uh, June. June is the earliest you can do it. June is the sixth month, right? But since I didn't talk to... Yeah, you're, you're right. Since I didn't talk to... Yeah. <laughs> right. Hi, I. Do I want to go somewhere? No. I like you, I, but... I have other things to attend to. Head to the living room. <laughs> Head outside. I'm fucking mad. I'm so mad. Oh, man. Well, I mean... When is the next dungeon, right? That's not until September 2, right? Because that's when you do the whole, uh, the field trip. Fuck, oh, when is... Damn it. No spoils. Listen, no spoilers for the story. <laughs> right? 
Like me, I beat the game already. It's no spoilers for the onlookers. Huh? Hang out with me, Marie. It will Let's deepen. Go. You damn right it will deepen. And Junaz. Got some change, so there's something I want to see. Decided to take Marie to Junaz. Or Junes, as the Americans call it. You decided to come here for the uh, for the rest after- Wait, what? I just had a stroke reading that. You decided to come here for a rest after talking to Marie. Talking to Marie. Taking Marie out. Why the fuck did I read it that way? Hey. I'm thirsty. I want something to drink. Something that isn't sweet. And not water. Alright, tea. You want oolong tea? I, I get you oolong tea. Oh, who's this girl? None of your damn business, Teddy. Oh. Is she your skirt? You're quite the naughty boy, aren't you? My skirt? What the hell is this thing? It's moving. Gross. <laughs> How rude. <laughs> Just <laughs> gross. How rude. How can you say that about cute little moi? And it talks? What's it made out of? Ahem. This teddy is 50% 50% kindness and buy volume. Huh? What about the other half? Teddy fur. Kindness and fur? Whoa. Oh, hey, it's you, Hemarichan. What you up to this time? Taking a tour of Junez? <laughs> oh, well, if that's what you're doing, I'm just the man you need. Welcome to Junez, Yasuina Buzz Branch. Yosuina, why'd I say it like that? Yasuina Buzz. Huh, I don't need a tour. I already saw it. Whoa, Yosuke got denied. Shut up. It's not like that. Yo. Yo, Yosuke. You know that CD I was asking about? Huh? Who's this? Who's this old timer? Old timer? Ah. I see what you mean. I mean, Kanji, can you be mad that they call you an old timer? You're fucking 15 with a widow's peak. What the hell? Like a super widow's peak. Like chasing after Vegeta's fucking ba da ba ba ba. I'm loving it. <laughs> Who are you calling old? What the fuck? What are you doing back there? Hey! Get away from my snacks. What are you doing? <laughs> I turn around. I just went shopping today. I went to like an Asian market. So I have like some like fucking uh... Like um... Shit. I have like some red bean fucking uh... Pancake things. Why can't I... Why can't I fucking manju and shit? Whatever. I got a bunch of snacks over there. Sitting out the corner of my bed. My f <laughs> turn around, I hear rustling going on. Turn around, my dog's just all over it. What the hell are you doing? I ain't never seen you doing some shit like that before. Stay away from my snacks, stupid. Kanzi, what are you yelling about? I thought you came to talk with Yosuke. Oh, oh senpai. Started eyeing her up and down. Jesus. Whoa. Senpai, who's this girl? And what is she doing with you? I know this person. I heard about her from Margaret. Someone even I can't handle? Yep, that's about right. It's not how it goes. It's something even I can handle. That's not so different. Yes, it is. Gee. Okay, Senpai, what's with this girl? Me? Uh, she's Marie-chan. Use mate. No way! Mate! Way to go, Yosuke. Way to go. Thanks. Sorry, I think I added fuel to the fire. Hmm? Oh, hey! Hey, hey, hey. Everyone's here. Huh? Everyone is here. We're not missing one person. The whole group is here. It's nice to see that we're all connected as a unit. <laughs> the golden unit, or as some people would like to call us, the G unit. Thank you very much. I'll be here all day. <laughs> oh, Marie Chan's with you, huh? Hello. Hmm. Simpies, you know her? 
We had fun together the other day, right, Marie-chan? <laughs> Yosuke moment, where's the fox at? You know what? I always feel bad for the fox. Because it's like, the fox goes into the TV world with you, the fox heals you, you hang out with the fox, but somehow Teddy is still the mascot. And I'm like, come on, guys. We all acknowledge that the fox follows us. Why don't we hang out with the fox more? Especially when you come off of Persona 3, and it's just like, oh, we got a fox instead of a dog? No, you don't. You got nothing. You got a bear. It's not even a bear. I don't know what the fuck it is. I don't recognize you. Which high school are you from? Wait. You're even younger than me. Which middle school are you from? Middle school? What's that supposed to mean? Wait, what? Maria's not yet. Wait, what? <laughs> Wait. What? Why couldn't the Fox have a persona? I don't know. I guess the same reason Nanako and Dejima couldn't have a persona in Ultimax. <laughs> Which is getting re-released next month. This month, technically, I think, right? Is it now the first? Yeah, it's now the first of March. This month? Can't wait. Hey! Why do you keep calling me old? You know, I don't know much about her either. How old are you, Marie-chan? Where you live? Are you here on vacation? What's your, so what's your social security number? I, I don't remember. Yosuke, you're scaring the poor girl. Yeah, senpai. Not very subtle of you. Hey, you brought it up. Wait, what? What the hell you just say? Subbuttle? Did you think the word subtle is pronounced subbuttle? Kanji's got a subbuttle. <laughs> Shut up! Quit talking about my butt. Gee. Ugh, why'd you make me think about your butt? <laughs> You're the most unsubtle person ever. The unsub, <laughs> unsubtle subbuttle. Oh, Yukiko, you, you don't disappoint. Just... Just golden comedy over here. <laughs> what is the link? What is what link? Oh, what is this S link? My bad, I read that wrong. This is, a uh, Marie's link. <laughs> Marie's, uh... What is it, rank 5? You spend time with your friends and Marie. After everyone is done hanging out, they go home. Those were funny people. I don't get them. They're loud and stupid. <laughs> so stupid, subbuttle. That's coming from Miss fucking Electric Loutwitz. Fucking. <laughs> Despite her complaints, Marie appears to be enjoying herself. You feel you have grown closer to Marie now. Yeah, it's rank 5 Marie's. You needed uh you needed to get Rize and Teddy on your team in order to finish the rest of her S Link stuff. Dead ass forgot about Marie. <laughs> Mainly because she didn't exist before Golden. <laughs> the Poochie of the series. <laughs> Did they all face their true selves? I see. I see. Um, I was thinking, maybe I should work on trying to get my memory back. Well, one of these days. They look like they were having fun. I want to be like that. I'll help. I'll help, he said with his voice cracking. <laughs> Please do. I'll help out, Marie! I don't know what to do. You decided to help Marie search for her memory. I'm not asking you to help right now, but when the time comes, I'm going to count on you. Let's go home. Oh, but let's go by the river on the way. Let's go by the river on the way. So well, let's walk. Let's ya. walk past your house. <laughs> let's let's go home. Oh, but let's see the river on the way. So we're going to walk past the velvet room, head to the river and then do a fucking 180 and run back to the velvet room. OK. Great job, Marie. Who will you romance? <gasps> Bro. I mean, as of right now, technically speaking, at, oh, there's delivery for me? Thank you, Nanako. And a prize sticker. So technically, as of right now, I am, I am dating Chie and Yukiko, right? But in terms of, 
in my opinion, I don't think nothing really counts until Valentine's Day. So, what's happening right now is I'm, I'm not playing the field, but I'm being as neutral as possible until I see people start fighting in the chat. Because we still have we still have to woo Rize and we still have another character we have to woo later on. Am I cheating? I wouldn't say cheating. It's not cheating if shit. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> for the play, listen. It's called waifu wars for a reason. At the end, there's gotta be losers, right? And there has to be one winner. So right now, it's fair game. It's not cheating if they don't find out. See, I don't want to say that. <laughs> oh, I wish I can talk to you, Nanako. You're cool. Um, fuck, I lost my train of thought. Damn it. I guess I'm just heading back upstairs, right? Which sir, what sun girl am I wooing? Oh, honestly, I I think I'm not gonna woo any of the students besides maybe I, mainly just to show off I's uh like romance thing, cause a I's pretty cool, and b her romance works. Her romance works different from other people's, kind of hers and like another character later. But uh, as for what sun girl we have right now that we're hanging out with, it's uh Yumi. Because, uh, whatever the fuck the name is, that other one, which I can't remember, that little Cretan, no one wants to hang out with her. <laughs> her fucking, her social link is so useless. I mean, both Sun Girls are kind of fucking useless. Ayane, thank you. Fucking, just, Senpai, I can't play the horn. Oh, now I learned how to play very mediocrely. Well, I guess I'm not gonna use my talent, and I'll just give up my spot to someone else. God. I'm unable to horn. <laughs> exactly. I'm enthralling now! Now I can hang out with Nanako! Great, because we have until November to do that. Her and Dojima. Those are like the last months that you can do anything with those guys. As for Adachi, we are done with Adachi for the time being. Do I think Kashiwagi should have a social link? No, I don't. I honestly don't. Like, even the first time I played the game, like, uh, I was like, oh, Kashiwagi's not that. Here's the thing. Kashiwagi shows up and she's all like, don't you guys want to fuck me? And it's like, I'm like, Kashiwagi's not that ugly of a person, but... The way she just acts is like, oh, you're so sleazy. I don't want to be anywhere near you. Ugh, get away from me. <laughs> like, she actually makes me feel bad, even though... Oh, here we go. Hyper reading. Thank you. Even though she's not, like... You know, she's not, like, unattractive. But it's, her personality is so unattractive that you're just like, don't touch me. You're unclean. <laughs> like, get away from me. Ugh. So, Kashiwagi, no. Now, if we're talking about Persona 3, and we're talking about Miss Toriyumi, I'm kind of mad the way they ended that. But it's okay, they made up for it with the- I don't know what the fuck's with Persona and Teachers. Because you have Miss Toriyumi in 3, right? But you don't do anything. Then, in P4, you have Kashiwagi, who's just super slutty, but you're just like, I don't want to be anywhere near you. And then Persona 5, they're like, all right, I guess this time we can make it so that you can snoo snoo with the teacher. <laughs> Which I remember, I remember the first time they announced that. I was like, wait, you can romance the teacher in this game? Finally! Yeah! And it turns out she's one of the best social links. I mean, listen, I'm not getting into any arguments, but... The only one I would put above her is that glorious, glorious forehead that we all love. Hang out with oh. me. What a coincidence. I just finished up. Actually, you know what? I kind of want to hang out with Yosuke. Sorry. Give me a moment. <laughs> Who's my best girl? 
For what? P4? I cannot disclose that information as of now. I have to be neutral. What's up? I cannot Hello. influence the waifu wars in any way. <laughs> they must fight it out. P3 and P5? Mm. P3... If I'm honestly gonna sit, like... P3's weird, because they have some weak... Some weak social links. Like, most of the actual good social links are the main cast. Um... Besides one, which is like... If I'm honestly gonna go for overall girl, probably Chihiro. Because she's like the only one that's kind of not like an idiot. Um, Yukari is just so fucking unlikable. But at the same time, she's so goddamn cute. And I'm so mad that I like her. But I fucking hate her. But I like her. Maybe if she took that choker off, I, I wouldn't like her as much. I don't know. Um, Mitsuru is just... Mitsuru's not bad. But she's just kind of meh. Same thing with Fuka. <laughs> right? Just kind of meh. Just kind of there. That and Fuka constantly sounds like she's out of breath. <laughs> Every five seconds. She's like, huh, huh. There are two enemies. Huh. <laughs> like, Jesus. So, uh. And, uh, what, what's the uh, chariot's name in that game? Yuko, I think her name is. She's just kind of there. I feel like the only. Honestly, I feel like the only thing she has going for her is that they're like, oh, she's the black girl. And I'm like, all right, what else does she do? Nothing else, really. <laughs> she's kind of just there. And I'm like, Jesus. So I guess Chihiro is good for P3. As for P5, um, fuck, there's a lot of good ones. And it's really hard. It's a constant battle. I'm trying to, right now, as of right now, I would say Haru's top for me. But again, you got Kawakami. And then you got fucking uh, Chihaya, the fortune teller. She's cool. Pretty much all the girls in P5 are cool. If I had to say who's the lowest in P5, it's probably Oya. And with second being On, because On's just kind of boring. An's whole thing is that she's half American, and that's all she has going for her. She's pretty, and she's half American. Don't you feel bad for the Hafu? She doesn't fit in with Japan. Feel bad for the Hafu. <laughs> and I'm like, wow, okay, An. But An does have, like, the best moment in the story, though. That beginning on that game is really good. Oh, yeah, I heard the girls are studying together for their license exams. Oh, I sh should uh, get a study group going and knock out the summer homework. Fuck you. I'm not doing the summer homework. Hang out All with right. me, Yosuke. The hill overlooking town. Yosuke bought you here. I hated this place when I first came to Inaba. You can tell how small the town is from up here. Yosuke, did your voice change? What happened, my guy? <laughs> Why does he sound different? Why does he sound like a fucking nerd? I hate it here when I first came to Inaba. But looking at it now, it's a nice town. Ah oh, shit, I guess fuck! You're so right! Wait, damn it, I forgot. Oh, I haven't played P3 in a while. Never mind, Chihiro, move the fuck away. And even you too, I guess, move out of my way. I guess is pretty cool though. Uh, top girl P3, Elizabeth. Fucking Elizabeth. Ugh. I fucking destroy the world for her. <laughs> P4 Naoto. Naoto will have her time to shine. And Hifumi. Hifumi's pretty good. Hifumi was originally supposed to be part of the team in P5. But she got replaced by someone else. Which I assume is On. I honestly assume she got replaced by On or either Makoto. Probably Makoto. Yeah, maybe Makoto. Makoto's a better fit for that. But yeah, Hifumi was originally supposed to be in your party. Yeah, Makoto. She would fit with that more than on, honestly. Because they're both, like, kind of uptight, strict households. Really stupid that they never let you date Psy. It's fucking dumb. <laughs> Yosuke smiling sadly. Ah, cheer up, buddy. Be a man. Stand up straight. 
Still sad about Saki? Eh, fuck it, I'll ax him. Hmm. Not as much as last time. But I still feel lonely. Yosuke's looking far off. I want to tell Saki-senpai something. That what's important isn't where you are. This town I hated so much. Now, I love it. I mean, there's still nothing here. But I have family and friends and you. The important things are never far off. They're all around you. Yoke seems a Yoke? Why the fuck did I say that? Yosuke seems a bit embarrassed. I always wanted to be special. I thought my life would finally have meaning if I was special to someone. That's why I was really excited when I got my persona. But I really didn't need it. It's not what you have or what you can do. Just being born, living your life. Before you know it, you're already special to someone. Man, you're right. Yeah, like you. You're special to me, you know? You can feel Yosuke's warm trust. Why you gotta say it like that? <laughs> His warm trust. Lusting over you. You feel your relationship with Yosuke has grown deeper. Nice. Yosuke Hanamura's social link has reached 9. Yosuke's determination in battle has enhanced. Yosuke can now die for you. Alright. Let's see if we can find everyone's house from here. There's Juness. And that's the main street, so... My house is there. The one with that funky roof. Meaning yours is... Yosuke, why was your voice so like... His voice was way different. Like the cadence in it. It was like lighter. Oh, welcome home, big bro. You know, Yosuke, Yosuke had the voice that people use when they answer the phone and they speak up and they speak in like a lighter tone. They go, hello? <laughs> uh, Dojima or Sojiro, who's the better dad? Mm. To be fair, I think it's kind of an unfair comparison, I would say, because in all fairness, Sojiro, my man holds it down. Sojiro lies to his own daughter for you. Like, what the fuck, man? Sojiro holding it down. But at the same time, Dojima, if you're taking everything Dojima has done, if you played a uh, Persona 4 dancing all night and you get to the second half of that story where it's just Dojima detective time, he fucking saves that story. Dojima pulls it off. He's like a full ass main character. <laughs> and he's it, really good. So I mean they're both they're both pretty cool, but it's just that Dojima has more stuff more stuff to show, right? He has more content there. But Sojiro Sojiro knows you for like a year and he's quickly he goes Within the same, within the same fucking year, that man Sojiro goes, Hey man, can you try not date my daughter? And then you date his daughter, cheat on her, and he goes, Don't worry, bro. I got this. I fucking lied to her for you. I said that he talks and thinks about you all the time. Make sure your story fits mine. <laughs> like, what the fuck? What's wrong with you? So, I don't know. I don't know if I can really compare those two, to be honest. So, you are the guys that's like, get your ass in the back seat. Uh-uh, only girls sit in the front. <laughs> so, Joe is fucking dumb. God. Or as, I, or as I know him to be, the third Hokage. <laughs> I think he's the third Hokage, right? That's the same voice actor? He's uh, the third Hokage, and he's also um, Junpei from Blaze Blue. The fucking cat. Oh wait, no. Why am I trying to work? I have my um, what you call it? Oh, I can't hang out with Nanako. Damn it. So I really don't know who's better. Maybe Sojiro. Maybe Sojiro. The fact that he's willing to lie to his own daughter. 
that's, kind of, that's like kind of fucking. That's like a gangsta ass move. It's so dumb. Man. Uh, if Zinkichi can have a persona, when will Dojima get one? Dude, fucking. So I did recently play uh, Strikers. And I didn't pay too much attention to the story because I knew I was going to do a playthrough of it, of it one day. So I didn't want to go too crazy with it, but I still wanted to play the game. So most of the details are fuzzy to me, but you know, with enough context clues, you can pick up on what's happening. First of all, that game is so good. That game is good to the point where if the next Persona game, like if someone was like, let's make another, let's make a mainline Persona game that I wouldn't even be mad because it's just good but uh the moment Zinkichi gets his fucking my spoilers by the way the moment Zinkichi gets his persona though I'm just sitting there I'm like bro this man just hopped straight out of fucking Bloodborne and then I'm sitting there I'm like what are we calling him are we calling him the hunter are we calling him the wolf and he goes call me wolf and I'm like get the fuck out of here Bloodborne ass mechanics Oh, I use my life, and then I take the enemy's blood to heal myself. Like, what the fuck, man? It's not a spoiler if it's on a box art. Was it on the box art? Shit. I have the... I have the case somewhere around here. Was it on the box art? I don't remember. Strikers is like a weird thing to me, where I didn't fully pay attention <laughs> to it. I was just playing it to have fun. That game is good. That game is stupid good. That game does not deserve to be that good. I would really like it if they had a... If that, whenever they do the next Persona, that they just stop with the high school shit and just have like some college students kind of go back to how persona 2 was a little bit you know because maya maya's in college uh yuki what was that her name yuki maya's friend the photographer she was also in the first persona uh she has a full-time job baofu's a grown-ass man you have tetsuya's fucking brother yuki no okay yeah and fucking nate Nate, that's his name, right? From the first one, he shows up. And it's just like a bunch of fucking adults. And it's like, this is great. This is good. I like this. And then fucking Persona Trinity started going like, oh, when you turn a certain age, you lose your persona. Despite the fact that Baofu's like fucking 40 something. <laughs> right? You can also be gay in P2. Can you? I don't think P2 has any romance stuff. Because P2 is, uh... P2, Lisa Silverman's all over, um... What's his name? Tetsuya. And then Maya's all over Tetsuya. And fucking... Yeah, that's pretty much it. You can say you have feelings for a male character later. Oh, really? Hmm, nice to know. Man, speaking about feelings for a male character, P3 Portable, Shinji Best Boy, no arguments, Shinji is Best Boy. I'd die for that man. <laughs> die for that man. That man goes into a coma and then I start dating his best friend. <laughs> well now that Shinji's gone, hey Akihiko, what? <laughs> Me? Oh, man. Uh, shit, what am I doing? Why am I just walking around? Take the bullet for him. Yeah. Oh, uh, fuck. I mean, let's be honest. Junpei's the real winner. He gets to hang out with fucking Chidori. Oh, hang out with me, Rize. Oh, senpai. Why are you saying it like that? Oh, actually, you know what? What? Don't cry, Rize. Give me a moment. I gotta make sure if Yosuke is hanging out. 
Ah, oh, damn it. Alright. Yeah, Riza, I'll hang out with you. Fucking Persona's great. I love Persona. The only Persona game that I have yet to play is Persona 2, uh, Persona Q2. Right? I have not played that one yet. And technically speaking, the uh, mobile game uh, that was Japan only for like flip phones where you play as Igus in a prequel. Right? That bullshit. Uh -huh. Yeah. It's kind of hard for me to like get into Q2 to get ready to play Q2 because after beating Persona Q, I'm just like, man, it's not. Man, this is not fun. And most of the characters just went back to being assholes, and I'm just like, ah. Teddy's genuinely actually fucking annoying. Yukari, for some reason, is less bitchy. I don't know how that happened, right? Fucking Naoto's super annoying, because I swear to God, she says the word deduction every fucking five seconds, and it's starting to piss me off. Never played Q, but you heard Q2 fixes a lot of issues. I hope it does. Also, Q was just kind of too fucking difficult. Like, even for a normal play playthrough, it was weird, man. <sighs> and it sucks because Q has, like, fucking two sides. It has the P3 side and the P4 side, and it's it doesn't really change much, much except for the perspectives of, like, what you're doing. I'm so not looking forward to the day when I have to do that playthrough for Q. God, I'm so gonna fucking cheat. <laughs> it's not even funny. Can't take another bite, my stomach's full. But they really hit the spot. I've been wanting to come here. But it's a little embarrassing to show up alone, you know? Oh, you don't eat out that much? <laughs> nope. If someone snapped a photo of me doing that, I hear it from my agency. The last time I ate out was at a festival when I was still a kid. Back then, it was me and my family. It was fun. Had an awesome battle theme, though. Oh yeah, Lotus Juice is the best. <laughs> <laughs> Love Lotus Juice. Going Gorilla's Banana. I honestly like the P3 version of that song better. And then Laser Beam. Laser Beam. Oh, so good. To tell you the truth, I wanted to do this since I was a child. My parents were actually pretty strict. I didn't really have many friends, though I guess that couldn't be helped since I hardly ever showed up for school. Uh, that's enough, that's enough talking about that. What a depressing subject, huh? Let's talk about something fun after all. I don't want to waste the time we have together. It's so great that I came to this town and met you. Really, I'm serious. Rize smiles naturally. I feel the relationship with Rize has grown deeper. Rank 2. Rize Coochie Coochie Q. She has learned weakness scan. Thank you. Very useful. You don't think. God, speaking about weakness scan, fucking Fuka is just the worst when it comes to support. Doesn't help at all. <laughs> Why don't I start by asking what kind of girl you like? Let's go, Senpai. Do Rize's. A barrage of questions until it became dark, then went home. God. Persona's great. Welcome home. I just hope with Persona's newfound fame they don't try and uh they don't try and cater to every single person in the planet. <laughs> Stick to their guns, right? I would like that. Speak to me, Nanako. What do you want? Okay. Uh, don't tell Dad, but... Nanako looks like she's about to cry. What happened, Nanako? What happened? Nanako looks nervous. They handed this out at school. They said to give it to our parents. When you first, when you first saw Rize, you read it like Rise, <laughs> not Rize. No, I, I, fucking, I, I had enough experience playing, you know, Japanese games where I went, I went, her name's like, pronounced phonetically, right? 
So is Rize. And I was like, man, some people might be losing their mind going like, yeah, let's head to June's and fucking go talk to Rise. <laughs> On that fucking note, though, in Persona 2, I remember uh, I was playing, you know, I was playing uh, Eternal Punishment. And I'm talking to someone while I'm playing it, and I'm like, yeah, because I'm hanging out with Yulala, right? Because her name is spelled fucking U-L-A-L-A, -L -A, and, you know, it looks like the word ooh -la, la right? And I'm like, yeah, but no one's gonna name their fucking child ooh -la, la so it's probably, like, some French bullshit, and it's Yulala. And the moment I go, yeah, I think her name's Yulala, and then fucking, she has a voice clip where she goes, I am ooh -la, la and I go, what? <laughs> I'm like, no fucking way that's your name. I'm ooh la la. Like, what the fuck? Why? Parent survey uh, regarding scheduling of parent teacher interviews. Interviews? Not conference? Just interview? That's kind of strict. Interview. They said to have our parents write down when they can visit the school. But dad's always working, so he can't come, huh? Yeah, I'll ask him with you. Really? Thanks, big bro. Nako looks relieved. I'll give this to dad. Same thing with Baofu, right? <laughs> Remember seeing Baofu's name for the first time? I was like, that. I'm like, that's pronounced Baofu, right? I'm not crazy. Would I play a Persona racing game? There's already one that exists. There's a fan-made racing game based off of, uh, like, the NES version of Mario Kart. I'll ask him to come. I'm glad I asked you. You can feel- Wait a minute. I didn't have enough expression to fucking tell Nanako I would ask her dad with her? What the fuck? See, I understand where she's all like, what happened when people dies, right? Big bro, do people die when they are killed? <laughs> I'll come. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Shit. Since he's my real dad, Big Bro, did you have parent-teacher interviews too? Were you nervous? You talked about different things with Nanako. Good night. It's getting late, so you put Nanako to bed and went to your own room. Being alone is lonely. <laughs> yeah. What was the thing from Code Geass about the fucking fish? I don't remember. There's some, like, translation bullshit about Lelouch and a goddamn fish. I remember being super funny though. I think people uh, die when they were killed is from like a Fate anime though, right? Fate, the anime series that started out as a porn, <laughs> as a doujin. I will now proceed to pleasure myself with this fish. Yep. <laughs> Lelouch. Also known as Zero. Yet another character I named my dog after. I remember being hyped for Code Geass, watching it, because it came out like around the time Death Note had ended. And I was like, I was like, this thing is kind of like Death Note, but just with more bullshit. <laughs> and everyone is just like super lanky tall and like fucking <laughs> twigs walking around. Oh man. Why did I walk in here? I walked in here thinking it was Aya's. Why did I do that? It's the daytime, by the way. It looks like nighttime. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, man. Fuck, I am not. So, I want to say back in November, I put up, like, a poll on, like, my YouTube uh, community tab about, like, doing a marathon. And a lot of people wanted Pokemon. And I'm finally at the point where I can start doing that. Oh shit, I'm supposed to read it. Fuck. Damn it. <laughs> At least once a stream I read the uh the rainy day mega beef bowl stuff. Shit. I was too busy talking, I forgot. I'll do it next time. Next time it's rainy day. Oh, I'm motherly now. Nice. Um But uh November I did a poll and everyone's like fucking do Pokemon. I was like, okay. And then I was holding it off because uh, there were some, like, I wanted to get some, uh, 
some artwork done for the thumbnail, which is, uh, that's done now. So, within, like, this week, what the fuck? What are you doing? Sit down. Why you keep fucking with it? <laughs> My dog is losing her goddamn mind. Get away from me! Stop! Both my dogs are crawling up to me. Stop it. Go sit. Get out of here. I'll let you outside in like an hour. Um. But yeah, so. Yesterday. I'm sitting there, I'm like, alright, it's time to get started. Time to start recording shit for uh, the Pokemon. Marathon and stuff like that. And then. Well, it wasn't yesterday. It was the day before yesterday. And then I forgot it was Pokemon Day. And I was like, wait a minute, today was like a fucking, um, uh, whatchamacallit. There was a, uh, uh, Pokemon Direct. Um. Nautica wants to hang out. Yeah. And then I watched the Pokemon Direct and I saw the announcement for the new Pokemon game and I went, fuck! <laughs> now I gotta play that too? Because originally I was just going to do it all the way up until Arceus. But I'm like, damn it, by the time I'm up to Arceus, I'm going to fucking... <laughs> God damn it, Gen 9's going to be out. And it wasn't like, you know, originally the plan was going to be just do the mainline Pokemon games. But I was like, fuck it, make it a Pokemon marathon. So, do the games from the beginning. Do some highlights and like spotlights and quick looks. At um, I like all the other Pokemon games, like the trading card game, uh, the ugly PC trading card game, <laughs> uh, Pokemon um, what's gonna call it, Pit Cross and shit like that. Try to get as much as I can put my hands on. So, you know, once I changed my whole mind about that. And I was like, well, guess I'll guess I'll do all the Pokemon things. And then I saw that direct and I was like, fuck, now I got to play that too. Damn it. I'm so mad. I'm going to hate Pokemon by the end of all this. See, we could have had it easy. People could have just voted for Spyro or fucking Ratchet and Clank. It could have been easy, but no, everybody wanted fucking Pokemon. Thanks a lot, guys. Thanks a lot. You want to watch Pokemon? Are you gonna choose Charizard? Pick Charizard. What about Blastoise? It's cooler than Charizard. Eh. Hang out with me, Murray. Wait. Excuse me? What the fuck did you say to me? Minding my own business. Coming to say hi to hang out with you. On a Sunday. My day off. And I walk up to you and you go. You're late. What? <laughs> and before you go looking for my memory, there's some place I want to go. I want to liven things up. Ooh, okay. Yes, ma'am. Maybe I am late. Let's go. Hurry, let's go. Take me out. Fly me to the moon. What's my rating of the Pokemon generations? Uh... I don't know, give me a second. <laughs> Emery's insistence, you have come here to eat steak skewers. Huh? huh? If it isn't you, Kuna Marichan. Oh, we meet again. Yo. Yo, Senpai, what are you doing here? What the fuck are you three doing hanging around? Oh. Hey, no fair, you're all here without me. If you could have called, you know. Everyone seems to have it gathered around. It's been a fun time with everyone, including Marie. Well, and it's grown yeah. late, so it leaves everyone. Wait, what? Yeah, it's grown late, so you leave everyone and escort Marie back to the velvet room. All right, cool. I don't know why. I don't know why that's like a mandatory scene to do. Welcome back. But it is for some reason. You can do Marie's whole entire social link without meeting Naoto. It's fucking weird. And then at the end, it's like, oh yeah, Naoto. <laughs> Yeah, I remember you! Um, but the Pokemon ratings... Well, since I'm going through all the games, my, my thoughts will probably change, but as of right now, ever since, like... Ever since I was a eety-weedy baby, uh... 
I have constantly stuck to my guns that I love Gen 2. That Gen 2 is my favorite. Alright. And I think it's because, uh, I think the reason for that mainly probably has to do with the Pokemon anime. Right? Like, even on, like, I don't think I've watched that many episodes of Gen 2, but I remember, like, everything in Gen 2 being newer, fresher, and shinier. Right? And not including the inclusion of shiny Pokemon. <laughs> but, um... I just have, like, I guess I have, like, this nostalgia glasses on for it, where, like, I think about Gen 2, and I'm like, yeah, all the, all the Pokemon in the anime, like, looked it brighter and more colorful. Spinarak is cool, even though I hate spiders, but I love Spinarak. Stantler's dumb looking, but I love Stantler for some reason. Right? Typhlosion and Quilava are fucking dope. Bayleaf is slept on. Meganium's really cool. Fucking Fraligator is a weird creature of the deep. <laughs> but Total Dial is like really adorable. And I want to just squeeze him. Alright. Eat in the steak bowl. No matter how much you eat, you just can't fill yourself. What is this for? Diligence? I just kind of... Oh, understanding. Okay, I just kind of went there. Has spent like a week thinking from best to worst. You would say uh, 5, 3, 8, 4, 6, 2, 1, 7. 7 is Sword and sh No, 7 is not Sword and Shield. 7 is uh, Sun and Moon. Um. Yeah, I feel like a lot of people gave Unova shit for no reason. They're like, they're not even trying with Pokemon designs no more. And I'm like, oh, yes, because the 151 were so great. Like, Magnemite, it evolves into three Magnemites. Muck and fucking Grimer, they're just sludge. Tauros is just a bull with three tails. Fucking Voltorb and Electro are just Pokeballs. Like, what? <laughs> Charizard is just a fucking dragon with nothing changed. Like... <laughs> Like, the designs were so fucking good in Gen 1. Like, no, they weren't. You got two starfish Pokemon. Like, you got a crab, for fuck's sake. Hello, it's me. Hi, I. You're very beautiful and pretty, and I love you. Uh Bye. Yeah, so Unova, Unova got a bunch of shit for no reason. Uh, like, I know a lot of people talk shit about Trabish and Garbodor, right? And especially everybody talk shit about vanilla, uh, van Vanellix, right? I fucking love that ice cream cone. I love that Pokemon. I love that goddamn Pokemon. It's one of my favorites. Everybody hated it. <laughs> and then everybody started hating on Al Creamy for no fucking reason. And I was like, all right, wait until Al Creamy becomes like so competitively viable, and then fucking I don't even care about competitive Pokemon, but. What ended up happening is people were like, okay, hold up, Alcremie's actually pretty fucking good, though. It has really good special attack and defense, it's really actually good, Alcremie's kinda really good. And I'm like, yeah, of course Alcremie's good. <laughs> um, shit, I don't know, if I were to say the worst Pokemon gen, I wouldn't say Sun and Moon, though. I mean, there are some Pokemon that just kinda suck. <laughs> <laughs> in Sun and Moon. But there are also some good ones that are there. Gen 4 is pretty good. I would say the worst one is fucking X and Y. Jesus. It's not the worst, it's just the least favorite. Yeah, okay. I can see that. Yeah, but I would say X and Y is just probably my least favorite. It's like most of the new Pokemon weren't that interesting. Uh, Mimikyu wasn't introduced until Sun and Moon, right? Mimikyu wasn't X and Y. So, you don't even have Mimikyu. X and Y had what, Aegislash? Fucking, I, like, I don't know. <laughs> like, what, what are the standout Pokemon of X and Y? It's like, Charizard X... Eveltal looks kind of cool, and Xerneas were kind of cool. Uh, Type Null is just the fucking weirdest creature ever. Wait, no, that's not X and Y, that's Sun and Moon, shit. 
Um, X and Y was weird. <laughs> X and Y, but X and Y also has fucking Talaflame, right? Talaflame is pretty cool. Fire flying. Damn. X and Y also have fucking Spritzy. That ugly fucking abomination. Only reason six is is in top five is because of Super Mystery Dungeon. I haven't played Super Mystery Dungeon. I played Mystery Dungeon Red Team when that came out, and I had like the strategy guide for it. Uh I think I beat that game, but I really don't remember. But whatever, I'm gonna end up playing it for the fucking marathon anyways. I might not do a full playthrough because those games are long as shit for no reason. Um and then I played uh, Keepers of, what is it, Explorers of Time on the DS. That one I didn't finish, so I don't know what the deal with fucking Grovile was with that shit. Um, and then Super Mystery Dungeon was the 3DS one, right? And I didn't even touch that one, so. Yeah. Mystery Dungeon's weird. I gotta get the, uh, I gotta get the remake for that, by the way. Oh my god, I gotta get the fucking remake for that. Damn it! <laughs> I forgot that thing existed. Shit! That's another thing I gotta play. I fucking hate Pokemon now. I hate Pokemon. I fucking hate it. This is garbage. Pokemon was a mistake. Should have just stuck to Digimon. Vmon's cool. I love Vmon. Vmon's my favorite. Um, let's see. Fucking what time is it? <laughs> well, I'm sitting here talking shit. Yeah, I'm a little bit over my stream time. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> All right. Damn it. So, uh, this is going to be it for Persona tonight, right? Did I save? I think I did. Well, who cares? Do it again, right? Um, I'm hungry as fuck. I need to get something to eat. This is going to be it for Persona 4 tonight. I started later than I would like to have, but, you know, that's just how my schedule goes. Um, next time I stream... Doing more Ace Attorney, a great Ace Attorney, right? Chronicles, the first one. First game. Gotta go back to that because I've given that game a break for like two weeks. And we're we're like towards the third. I wanna say the uh the uh third part. Third part? Third part. Why why does that not sound right to me? We're on the third chapter, but we're at like the uh the third half of it, I guess. Third half, that makes no sense because it wouldn't be a half of its thirds, but you know what I mean. The third thirds. <laughs> um, so we're in that area. We're heading to trial with... Uh, to defend the Japanese man. I forgot his name already. Fucking that crazy dude. He was... Uh, what was it? He's being framed for murder, I think. Someone got stabbed and... He was, and he was seen fleeing the scene or whatever. Some bullshit like that. So... Gonna continue with that. Uh, that's on the stream schedule, right? As for YouTube, like I said, sometime this week or next week, mostly this week, uh, expect the Pokemon Marathon to start up. Going to be starting with Pokemon Blue, right? It's going to be a pain in the ass for me <laughs> to fucking do. Going to be starting with Pokemon Blue and then, you know, so on and so forth. Going to, I'll explain more about the scheduling for that. Um... We're now in March, and I'm still uploading fucking episodes for uh, Nightmare Before Christmas because i just been lazy and haven't been doing that. So, uh, Nightmare Before Christmas, that's still ongoing. Uh, Oogie's Revenge. And then uh, I have the two streams of... The two last streams of um, Vampire the Masquerade, so those are going to get... Uh, they're already uploaded, they're just not published, so I'll just do that later today, this morning, sometime. So that's it for the YouTube page. YouTube page? Yeah, that makes sense. Great. As for Twitter, Twitter's right there. For who, anyone who wants to follow me or anything like that. Whatever the fuck, I don't care. Right? <laughs> uh, right now, I'm fucking... Right now, in my own personal life, I'm too busy fucking trying to grab as many Wii U games as I can. Because Nintendo loves fucking us over at the most un uh, unopportune times. Fucking Nintendo. God damn it. God damn it. And I managed to grab some Wii U games yesterday. I also managed to grab uh, Final Fantasy anthologies for the PS1 yesterday. That was cool. Rip eShop. I know. I mean, there's only like five, 
five five or six games that really matter for the Wii U that haven't been uh put over to the Switch, which is like the two Zeldas, um Xenoblade two Zelda Xenoblade, what like fucking what's the other two that really matter that I can't remember right now? <laughs> they matter, I just can't remember. Uh Star Fox Zero and then and then what's the other one? Shit. Shit. Can't remember. Can't remember. But I had like a I had like a oh, Paper Mario Color Splash and shit like that. Yeah. Fucking It sucks. That and I'm happy that I bought it when I could cuz I'm going to have to use that DS emulation to record uh to have a comfortable time recording the Pokemon Ranger games because Pokemon Ranger Trilogy is on there. Also, if you don't have Pandora's Tower, which is kind of a rare game to get for the Wii, uh, that's on the eShop on the Wii U for fucking 20 bucks. So grab that shit. Like, for real. Because that's a hard game to get. Goes up in the hundreds, man. It's fucking stupid. <laughs> Says the guy who bought Godzilla for the PS4 for like 230 bucks. Anyway. But, um, you know, I'm having a little bit of a panic grabbing as much Wii U games as I can. Managed to get my hands on a PS2 as well because my PS2 broke, so I got I got a PS2. I can play some PS2 games. I mean, I can always emulate them, but I, I want to play, play on PS2 sometimes, you know what I mean? But anyways, that's it for the stream. Thank you to those who came and watched live. I greatly appreciate it. Right? If you're not followed... Please think about following. If you are followed, thank you. For those on YouTube, when this gets uploaded, uh, if you like what you see, think about subscribing. If you're already subscribed, click the bell and click that like button because it helps with notoriety for YouTube and all that other bullshit, right? That's going to be it for me. I got some Pokemon to start recording and some emails I have to answer and shit like that, but... Yeah, next time we come back, I'm going to be doing some Phoenix Wright, and my throat is going to be sore because I'm going to be reading fucking out loud the whole entire time. My illiterate ass. So, that's it for me. Once again, thank you all for stopping by, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay happy, stay healthy, and take care. Bring water? Oh yeah, no, definitely. Definitely. I always bring water. I always bring water, but it doesn't help. Like, outside of these streams, I actually don't really talk that much. Outside of my streams and my recordings, I don't talk that, I don't talk that much. I'm kind of kind of like a quiet guy. But that's it for me. I'm out of here. See you guys later. I'm a chef what else should I be? Please don't take off my...